Questions with DC. <laughs> I should. <laughs> That'd be dope, though. <laughs> questions, 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 questions with DC. Merch. It would be dope. Again? Merch. Mm-hmm. You gonna leave money on the table? Mm-hmm. <laughs> I left hella money on the table this week. You always leave money on the hella. table, man. At least bring a, a little DC don't backpack care. worth of oh, taking uh, 5% of that. Well, first of all, <laughs> thanks for Mm-mm. getting here. Hey, guys. Coming in, just trying to jump in the comments. Come in hot. You, you can't be late and hot. 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 Wrestling, <laughs> yeah. all kind of stuff. Mm-hmm. Like come he was here around. a little bit earlier. Okay. Hey, man. Late I come in humble. Huh? Late come in humble. None of you have ever seen me late come man. You ain't saying hi to no Keon. one's ever been in here. But. You ain't say hi to me. You ain't say hi to DC. I always, when I come in late, I me make too. sure I be like, "What up, Tony? What up, Keon? Hey, I Chaz. apologize immediately. Sorry, what up, DC? Sorry, I'll say sorry. Then I tell you, I'm out of business while I was late. Why I, was you late? I told you guys why I was late. I couldn't find my phone. Izzy had my phone. You text us that. I text you that because when I find my phone, then you have your phone. Well, that's clearly when I found the phone, Craig. I was thinking that when I was thinking that when he said I can't find my phone. I was like, what? DC Same. thought his car was stolen. I thought my car was yeah. smooth. <laughs> it was, bro, that's an empty feeling. It is. It is an empty feeling. DC it was, knew it was stolen. Bro. Though. Like, they got me. <laughs> <laughs> bro. Like, he, didn't even, he didn't even say I might have parked. He came out the gate. My car was stolen or it was towed. Yeah. Yeah. Right, you said you parked in the it. stall. You thought you did. I, Are your tags n- bad? No, Because no, there's no. got to be that fear of like, I know I've been fucking well, on, up. on my main street is gridlock. Uh-huh. So when you have a gridlock sign, that means they don't be playing around. Right, right. They'll, they'll tow it if that. it's not there. I thought I was going to leave my house again last night or whatever the case is, but I just fell asleep. Oh, okay. And you left my car out. like on the street. Yeah. When I looked at my stall, I just... How did they get it this clean? It was no glass broken or nothing. <laughs> yeah. That's how they steal my that car this clean. Then like I they was walked good. down a little bit and saw it. I just, thank yeah. God. But I was already in my head, like, let me text the gang. You was already uh, <laughs> calling the <laughs> Maybe fair in the worst. You see your car is gone, you be like. I was ready to pay. I was like, it's going to be about three fifty because they, they, they couldn't have had it too long. Right. You know what I mean? But, bro, mm. I was already like, it's gone. <laughs> it is gone. Man, I thought you were not going to tell us what happened. It was going to be about $350, too. It was going to be about three fifty easily. Yeah. No, I was going to tell I, Yeah, I was going to tell y'all, but I was just like, let me get the car <laughs> first. Like, is he going to tell us what happened to the car? <laughs> I would have came out. once he said false alarm, he was quiet for a minute. Yeah. Yeah. But <laughs> I figured it out. Like, he, he realized he parked well, somewhere else. You remember else. where you yeah, parked. I, just, like, I remember. <laughs> uh, it just wasn't directly in front of my house. It was, yeah. I parked like in another in front of another apartment building. And I was like, did you park in the driveway of the apartment building? I did that before, but Chaz, is I think you did it most you recently. Yeah, sure. I did it a few years ago, sir. Did. <laughs> yeah, he sure. was looking at you. Oh, <laughs> I, I, uh, I was so tired, bro. I parked. I mean, I, I remember I circled, and I couldn't find a parking spot. And I circled back, and I was like, "Oh, one just freed up." Park came back. My was gone next morning. I oh, said, yeah. "Who stole my shit?" The apartment complex did. I think that's the only time they should really tow you is if you blocking something. Yeah, you blocking in oh, the whole community. Yeah. A whole community, right? Yeah. right. Yeah. yeah, especially uh-huh. apartment complex. You done ruined the lives <laughs> of multiple people. Right. <laughs> you imagine you trying to come out. You are like, yo, there's a whole vehicle. You already running late. For and work. the only way out, kids late for school. It's the one you way in, lives. one way out. Right. <laughs> I remember when I thought my car got stolen. I ran outside and actually went looking. Me and Damien, we started walking around like the car thief was still there. <laughs> like, like he was a kicking. Yeah, like, the corner. Nah, let's go this leave. way. We yeah. walked. We was like, nah, all right, maybe he went around this way. Was you walking hard? <laughs> we, 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 was running. we ran to the corner. <laughs> but obviously, he stole it sometime during the night. But uh, we ran to the corner like, where are you at? Uh, I'll tell you the dumbest thing I did. I... Outside of that, it's something dumber outside oh. of than parking in a... Uh, oh, fill us in. I, I think I was going out one night uh, in the stand-up world, but I took the red line down. But mm-hmm. I parked at the red line, okay? So I had to work in the morning. I came back. I walked from the red line to the crib, mm-hmm. okay? I didn't go... No, I had somebody drop me off at the crib. So I never went back to the red line to get my car. Oh, you forgot you you forgot you. You, you drove probably there. dropped me off, oh, honestly. You mother. And so I left the car. So I woke up the next day to go to work, could not find my car. Uh-huh. I said, dog, it's gotta be here somewhere. I'm going up and down the street. Like I had to park somewhere. I'm like, all right, retrace your steps. Could not figure out. Went back inside. Was like, fuck, hey guys, I my car got stolen or towed. <laughs> not gonna figure That's me. it out. Yeah, and I was like, oh, Jesus, Chaz, this is like the eighth whatever. I'm always late. Like, hey, I went back outside. I was like, there's no way. And I was like, fuck. Started walking to the red line. I was like, you, mother, how are you this dumb that you didn't realize car sitting there empty? Only car in the whole lot. <laughs> <laughs> it's like, yeah, at four in the morning. Chaz. Man, that was the one I was like, that's the dumbest thing. I've done vehicle wise. And somehow it must have put Tony out of his way. 
because all your dumb shit affects Was, was you staying with me then? Nah. Okay. This uh, was, uh, okay. I was staying with Tiff at the time. Okay. Ironically, mm, I, I didn't have <laughs> a plenty ticket. plenty of those though, Craig. <laughs> I didn't have a ticket on my car this morning, and I should have had a ticket. So it made me be like, are they doing the, uh, where they, because when COVID first hit, remember there was a point mm. where you weren't getting any yeah. tickets. Yeah. yeah. So I think we might ba- be back in that in that situation. They just not telling us. Oh. Nah, I had no ticket. You in. I remember that. That's when I caught my uh, speeding ticket. Like, no, I'm not. A, I'm talking about parking. Man, you can't. They, they, yeah, you can't. Just leave. Leave. Those, you know, law. That that speed speed law. Law. They're like, hey, man, they ain't giving no tickets. Nah. You can go as fast as you can. Well, what? I'm going to 120. It's COVID. <laughs> Through a just school act zone. Like you got COVID. <laughs> I can Craig rob said. a bank because it's COVID. No. Craig said it was purge, baby. Yeah. Like, yeah. No parking tickets. Craig was like, let me get these keys off real quick. I don't parking, bro. I said, the law is still apply. <laughs> <laughs> we are back with another episode of Daddy Issues. Beep, 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 beep. Get an early uh, You didn't want to wait till two hours in? Nah, uh, man, we got to give it the, give the yeah. early <laughs> intro. I like the two hours in. That was probably pretty yeah, dope. That, was, uh, that was, was the longest one. It was like breakfast for dinner. Mm. Yeah, oh, mm. that's the best thing. That's that what, breakfast yesterday. for dinner? Mm. You had breakfast mm. for dinner yesterday? Two, yeah. No, two nights ago. What'd you have? Uh... Potatoes, eggs, bacon, cheese. Mm. You know what's a good Pico alternative to guy. potatoes? Ro- uh, roasted Brussels sprouts. Toast. <laughs> I want all the way. That's really good. good. Roasted Brussels sprouts are a good alternative. I actually did a Rus- uh, uh, Russell sprout hash a Russell brown. Russell sprout? A Russell sprout? A Russell sprout hash brown. That, brown <laughs> that uh, One of those. Russell sprouts. <laughs> Russell sprouts. Russell sprouts. You know what Russell sprouts are. They're oh. just like Brussels, but they're brown. Oh, and so they take bad shots. <laughs> oh. <laughs> <laughs> they have too many turnovers. <laughs> Uh, but I did it as like a hash brown and it came out really dope. So if anybody's looking for a potato alternative, you can do it with hash browns. There you go. There you go, guys. Don't tap me because you're going to invite in. all of them to breakfast and you won't invite me. I didn't invite anyone to but breakfast. But you would. Craig. I would invite everybody but you. <sighs> that used to be cute when I was younger, breakfast for dinner, but now I'm like, mm. Oh, you think you're better than breakfast? I want what I want. I want lunch for lunch. Dinner for dinner. Breakfast for breakfast. Nah. I'm not a breakfast dude anyway. Oh, there you go. Do you mix it? Like, my son had a waffle burger the other day, and it looked good. Okay. It was like two waffles with burger. Was it Ego? They had bacon. No, it was real waffle. Oh, he made made two waffles? We we went to this spot in Alhambra that specializes in burgers, but man. It looked good. I was just like, damn. What'd you get? You didn't ask for a portion? I got like a chicken sandwich. Yeah, you, didn't take, you didn't dad text Right. Nah, nah that, with, with a big kid like that, dang, you he came really and got in your the real car sucking his fingers because he started eating it on the way to the <laughs> Ah, I never had a chance. Yeah. That sounds good, though. Nah, certain stuff don't. That didn't sound good to me. Yeah, waffle and a, a waffle burger. waffle and a burger? Why not? Yeah. It looked good. Sounds great. Y'all do it, it with sausage. Like nah, burger's that. different, though. Burgers I don't, like, I don't make yeah. A, so yeah. Not the sandwich, yeah, like a, like but a, you eat them together. Sausage, Chicken and waffle barely made the cut. Maybe like a sausage uh, breakfast sandwich or some shit like that. You've had one of those. That's nah, I've had an egg burger before. I've had egg. I had that this morning, actually. A what? Egg burger. Egg burger's okay. Yeah, oh, I don't, I don't you want want on this. Yeah, that's fair game. That's a called local a local. What's wrong local. with the waffle bread that's throwing you off? The wa- It's just too, the bread be too thick. Oh, okay. Like it depends on like if you get the thin <laughs> waffle, yeah, that's maybe. A, there's no but even that, thing you can get like what about waffle. what about was it a Belgian waffle in the in the well, burger? That's a big ass. That's a big ass. That's waffle. what I'm thinking. That's what I envision. Nah, I'm pretty sure it's a hand waffle. It's just like bread. Yeah. It's thinner than most but, breads. But I don't, I don't want. It got a little syrup sweet to it. It looked like. Feet. Like I don't. I don't Talk want your shit. syrup. Like an egg McGriddle. If you get a good enough waffle. There's syrup, there's syrup It'd in the McGriddle, good for the burger. But I feel like sausage goes with like the taste of it. Like the taste of a burger don't go with it's a different taste. Sweet to there's me. no yeah. such thing as a like, maple burger. Yeah, like I don't it like is. that. I mean, yeah. it is, maple, but I, bacon, I don't want that. <laughs> yeah. they they the ba- the bacon is yeah. maple, but See, not the sure burger. Of bacon. They got maple burgers. But they got maple sausages. They got any kind of burger you can I'm pick up. They got a maple burger. I'm sure they have it, but what menu they was like, this is a maple burger. Yeah, I don't want, like, like I this don't beef want that. is maple. I agree that I have not seen it out in the box. I haven't, haven't seen it on the menu <laughs> somewhere. Never. But maple sausages? Yes. yes. Of course. Of course. Well, maple what, what's sausages. up with you in this chicken and waffle beef that I you I don't got? think it I mean it goes together because we forced it on the world. Like chicken and waffle. <laughs> <laughs> I've never been before. No, I'm saying that's been like Take it's like a thing now, waffle. you know, but yeah. when it first I'm pre- I'm pretty sure when it first happened they weren't like Oh, this but is... in your defense, when I when I go to chicken and waffles place, my chicken is on a different plate than my wa- like. I don't put the syrup on my chicken. I, I eat the chicken. Dog, the syrup yeah. on the chicken is actually fire. And on then the fried I, don't, chicken. I, don't, 
I don't mix. I don't like syrup on a lot of stuff other than my pancakes and waffles. Pancakes and waffles, my syrup bro. Off French the toast. That's what yeah, it's for. That's it. No, it's actually underrated on fried chicken. It was really good. I don't want it. Honey on fried chicken is. It's in the same way, bro. You can't go. You it's can't. in the same world. No, sweet and sweet. It's definitely in the same world. It's in there. They're cousins. It's a, you, agave, step maple. Yeah, all those. those are they're the same world. They're cousins. Foster kids. Foster kids. They're not foster. No. They're foster like they're related. <laughs> well, one <laughs> bee, one's tree. It's, it's not but, blood. But it's all they're related, man. The... One bee, one's tree. So <laughs> one's a plant. But they're all in the same. Yeah, way. yeah. I, to, to your defense, yeah. To to to. They're all in the same vein, bro. Foster family. No, they they actual family. <laughs> Cousins for real. <laughs> Ain't no foster. Nothing. They in the same family. If syrup came from trees. It does. Well, come maple, from trees. yeah. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Syrup, yeah, syrup sorry, does. DC, I get sorry. what you're saying, because they are like a guy. I mean, I'm gonna say honey. Yeah. Honey mm. came from trees, but honey does not come no, it's from trees. Oh, it's bee shit. So you Is know? It? No. Honey, no, it's not bee shit. Yeah. <laughs> it's bee it's bee vomit, pretty much, ain't it? Yeah, it's pretty it's delicious. <laughs> Damn, it is. This is gross. It's gr- delicious. <laughs> I, I prefer the vomit me, over baby. the shit. Yeah, but no doubt. Oh, definitely. <laughs> What'd you say? <laughs> I said, you call? You call me, baby. Yeah, I prefer the vomit over the shit. Yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah I don't know why, but yeah. yeah. I know there's somebody that like, nah, blah, 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 dog vomit. Nope, 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 not it. Dog shit. It's like, <laughs> yeah, they're both like, oh. Nope, yeah. nope, nope. I've seen my dog puke. It is not. It is so nasty it is when a dog pukes. Fun. And I'm sure bees don't puke like, oh. I bet this probably still cute. Bees are cute, man. Sometimes when the dog puke, you be like, "What's that taste like?" Because they go straight to. Go oh yeah, right cats do it too. Mm-hmm. They, they lick that right back. Their shit, they lick like it. if they throw up and you can see it's food, you can clearly see. Oh, you just ate cat food. They'll be like, "Let me get back." <laughs> <there."> <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> But if it's that. like a hairball, they won't mess with it. But if yeah. it's like food heavy, I seen food in my mouth. Nothing about it was like. Be like nah, yeah, I yeah, could yeah, see you. Yeah. One like, time I threw some, up. The cat was ah, eating it. I swear. Yeah. 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 I seen the dog. This eat. was years ago when I was a kid. I watched American Werewolf in London for the first time. Threw up in my sleep. Woke up and the cat was like. And I was like, man, what the hell's happening? Uh, to me? <laughs> <laughs> like, the cat was putting his fur finger down your throat. Mm, <laughs> man, he <laughs> probably made me do it. Give me some more of that. Yeah, yeah. I know you had tuna last night. <laughs> Give me some more of that. Cue Every time you sleep. <laughs> I definitely had tuna that night, too. That's probably uh, what made me throw up. <laughs> <laughs> I, had a, I had a weak stomach. Had bro, the can, egg particles in there. Can tuna is, is cat food, bro. I don't like canned tuna. I, I can eat tuna as a fish. Mind. But in a can, it's, it's, it's so much like cat food. It's, it bothers me. I used to get canned tuna, throw it in the bowl. That's what I came up with. Like, I had to find mm-hmm. regular, real, regular yeah, fish tuna. You didn't get real tuna until you get I never even messed with tuna like that until I got older. I just couldn't do it in a can. Real tuna don't taste like canned tuna. Nah, nah. Y'all too bougie in this podcast. This right. is gross, bro. Sorry oh, for having no, a right? <laughs> like <you probably. laughs> Exactly. <laughs> so you put mayonnaise or Miracle Whip in your... Uh, mayonnaise. mayonnaise. Oh. I like Miracle Whip, too, but I, mayonnaise I'm actually is... down with both. They're different. I'm not, I'm not a big don't... fan of the Miracle Whip. They're different, man. Miracle Whip put mayonnaise on anything or Miracle Whip on anything of mine. I'm, please. We not friends no more. Yeah, how you make I'm your tuna? Come I love mayo. Oh, I'm mayo, 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 mayo head. Get rid of I don't it. love I don't mayo, but I don't no more, but dislike it like everybody does. I used to no put it mayonnaise. on everything. Oh, I can't stand it. Thousand Island mayonnaise? Yeah. Once I had a burger with mayonnaise on it, it was a wrap for me. <laughs> <laughs> My mom called, it's a Mississippi burger. Mayonnaise don't taste like anything. What does it yeah, taste dude, like? It tastes like a little something. Yeah, it's subtle, though. Taste, yeah. But I'll that's what that. I want. I don't want overpowering right. and stuff. And then it, and then I'm it, here. Yeah. I just want the moisture of the yeah, mayonnaise. So the I'm here for the, the sandwich. Right. What about the mustard? You don't want the m- I, but mustard? But the mustard be overpowering, too. I just want mustard. The, has a flavor. Mustard is that's a strong. Taste. Mustard, mustard be like, I'm like, what, bitch? Relax. But honey mustard? Fire. Oh, that's my favorite. Mustard takes the meat taste off of it. Taste that. It takes that gamey taste Well, meat for meat's sake is not good. I don't want unseasoned meat. No. Like people just well, eat meat. Uh, unseasoned, unseasoned salmon or tuna, I'm fine with. Oh, the fish, yeah. yeah no, fish. this is like ground beef. Uns- nah. No, it's just meat for meat. Sake? Turkey, chicken, beef, none of that. Yeah. You know, no yeah. seasoning is trash. Yeah, so I feel you there. You know what I'm saying? I can do a burger, salt, pepper. Yeah, but I see simple ingredients. Yeah, not no simple. Lowry's is seasoning. Salt and pepper count as seasonings. Mm-hmm. Right? It's spices. Yeah, salt and pepper yeah, is definitely spices. seasoning. They count as spices. It's just not it's like the basic. Well, yeah, yeah the basic still it's still a seasoning. Yeah. It's bottom. salt is definitely yeah, lay, a layup seasoning. is still a point. You know what I'm saying? It ain't always got to be a dunk, baby. You know what I mean? <laughs> <laughs> but actually, but really? salt pepper, <laughs> salt pepper is the bare minimum. That's, That's the like, basics. Yeah. yeah. You hit me with a basketball term. Everybody all else got fancy after that. When you start getting into garlic and a lemon, that's when you season. If you have. Uh, spaghetti, 
without salt, it's trash. Once you put some salt in there, you'd be like, yo, I'm the greatest chef <laughs> of all time. It well, should the, be enough salt in that sauce, though. Yeah, yeah the flavor definitely. comes from the sauce. It's not, not as the, good. You once, you, once you spice it with a little salt, you'd be like, yo. Depends on what kind of sauce you use. Right. Like, well, yeah, spicy yeah. Noodles I was too? using the, not the noodles. Some people do. Some people Probably do the butter. Idea, and, uh, if you're going to say, like, or, what's that, oregano, I would be like, yeah, that gives it a kick. No, but salt, salt, salt makes a huge spaghetti? difference in most foods by salt itself. Salt does. By itself, salt is a When I cut back on salt, I noticed a difference in life. I was like, this sucks yeah. it's like, a big difference man. but if you add more vegetables you don't need as much salt or different things for sure like if so you like when people like peppers. a lot of people ground turkey or beef right and they just season it but if you put bell pepper onion mm-hmm. celery, all that in there you don't need as much salt right. you got, it got plenty of flavors Agreed. like when when people want like when i be like cutting back when it's time to like shred up i just use more vegetables versus salt on, on whatever i'm cooking What's the amount of sodium for y'all that's like too much when you're reading the package? Oh, I don't eat a lot of packaged uh, food anyway. Yeah. Um, Once I see 300 plus, I'm out. Mm -hmm. That's really small though. That's yeah, a lot. once I see not, not per serving, we have thousands yeah. in per serving. Well, yeah, like yeah. them canned chilies and stuff. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Like, yeah. You'd be like, yeah. one hundred and eighty thousand. You'd be like, three hundred. Maybe I'd be like, all right, I don't need this. Right. Yeah, but that three hundred mm. and up. I'll be looking at that stuff. I'll be like, God damn. But everybody be watching the sodiums and not watching the sugars, though. Right. The sugars be high, and people just be like, uh. Oh, people don't be watching right. shit. Yeah. They don't watch sodium <laughs> or sugar. Barbecue sauces, crazy sugar. It's amazing yeah. when you read a package. Mm-hmm. Like, oh, you read it? Change the game. Yeah. I'll be like, I My daughter's it. yogurt, bro, was like 16 grams of sugar per yeah. soda. Yeah. Yeah. Is this a bitch? Yep. That's yeah. on the lower Yeah, I used to eat yo play. So you stopped yeah, eating them? I don't 20s. eat yogurt like that. I don't believe you. <laughs> yeah, I've been trying to go for zero added sugar. I eat the yeah, actual I fruits. Just, I, I take the I natural sugar. I say 10 and under is mine. Same go with honey. Okay. You got to get the ten and under. With zero added stuff in there, right. zero added mm-hmm. sugars. Well, that's honey. what it is. It's not so much salt and sugars. It's where you're getting it from. Mm-hmm. That's where people mess up. Right. Like, if you eating apples and orange, there's a lot of sugar in there. But yeah. it's good sugar. Like, even right. when it comes to your fats, if you're eating nuts and avocado, those are good fats. Right. Versus a... Cupcake, then it's like, well, no, you're not. Yeah. You know, it's where you're getting it from, what kind. But people just be like, it was all the same to me. Yeah. So you are you one of those parents that uh, are like, no sugar for my kid? Because I gave my kids candy nah. coming up. Nah. I was like, go I'm ahead. I'm not going to take that joy. It. They had a brownie yesterday. I'm not going to take that joy. <laughs> <laughs> it's so good. But they, they're definitely um, moderation people. Like, we do everything in moderation. And they eat spinach with, like, every single meal. So and like if I out, so. if I don't put it in their food, they'd be like, "You forgot my spinach." Spinach is great. Yeah. Well, well for Tony, kids, Tony is spinach head too. For Man. kids, it's dope though because you just cut it up and sprinkle it in whatever they're eating: tacos, mm. burgers, whatever they're Smoothies. eating. You just put the spinach oh, in there, man. and they'd be like sandwiches. Like Keelan eats sandwiches or wraps every day: mm. chicken, spinach, and his sandwich or wrap. That's it. Mm. They don't do no sauces. They don't do. They just eat that. Or they take it straight. Yeah. No it's, chaser. It's straight, sometimes no you chaser. might want some ketchup, maybe. Mm. Other than that, they just eat it. So I don't I mind when they be like, day, Dad. let me get a burner. Or let me get a brownie. I'm like, all right, y'all you eat spinach. Are you earned it. You eat spinach every day. Yeah. Yeah, Put spinach through. in the brownie, though. <laughs> they probably <laughs> need it. Yeah. Keep it going. They can't taste it. Because spinach is subtle, man. Yeah. You can put it in anything. It. Nobody will ever know. Spinach don't get a strong flavor until you cook it. Mm-hmm. When you cook it, it's like, all right, it there's spinach here. But when you chopped up, it's small. And it shrinks into nothing. No. You put a whole 10-pound bag. It makes no sense, bro. But you cook them, too, because you're cooking the nutrition out, so you might as well eat it raw. Man. I'll be dumb. chopping it up, throw it in there. That's what I had last night. Oh, really? When you cook it, the nutrition is Any gone? vegetables, the more you cook it, the more you're taking out of it. Yeah. I, so I think, you it, want to try I think to it works if you boil it because all that stuff is in there. Microwave and zaps it out. I think if you yeah. actually cook it and eat it, whatever it's no, made, it right? Still takes no. it. Microwave doesn't? It's in the water. Yes. Right, you have to drink the water. Microwaving doesn't because there's no water to steam the food. Yeah. Microwaving is the way to do it if you're going to eat the vegetables. Oh, well, there you go. Oh, well, there you have it. Steam them in the yeah, yeah steaming steam is fine. The then don't steam, steam too long because then they get all soggy. Yeah. Mm. Unless you yeah, like you soggy vegetables. Like, yeah, unless you like the soggy. Some people like soggy vegetables. Some people like soggy, soggy vegetables. People Girls. getting in this habit of barely cooking the broccoli. I don't like it. I don't I like, like that it. at all. I need yeah. that crunch. Nah, it's a little crunch, crunch, but I don't want it's a, the whole... That's, it's too much crunch. I don't, I don't want, want it in between broccoli. my teeth. I can't have no soggy. I can't be like... I you want to eat a whole tree broccoli. You want to squish broccoli? Yeah. I just want to cook like what's the what's the kind you get the long what's the long ones? Oh, broccoli. Yeah, broccoli. like cook it like that, like not all the way, but not too soft, just right in the middle. Where it look like somebody who can't get it up, like just uh, <laughs> just like limp broccoli. Limp broccoli. Speaking of limp broccoli, yeah, blue chew. 
Yeah. <laughs> Ad break. <laughs> ah, you clever bastard. Speaking <laughs> of Flint Broccoli. <laughs> it's 2022, so let's start the new year with a bang, huh, guys? Hey. hey. Huh? That's right. This episode is sponsored by Blue Chew. Uh, confidence can, can take you far in life. I think we all can agree with that, yeah. right? You got confidence. So, and it also helps in the bedroom, right? That's half the battle, the confidence, confidence in the, in the bedroom. bedroom. Agreed. Especially when it comes to when it's time to step up to the plate, if you will. That's where Blue Chew comes in. Blue Chew is a unique plate, online he service. Means vagina. <laughs> <laughs> it's a unique online service that offers the same ingredients as Viagra and Cialis, but in chewable tablets at a fraction of the cost. Mm. All right, so they show up, they deliver it. It's in a discreet box. Nobody knows what it is. You take it out. You got your pills. You pop one, and then you pop up. You know, you know what I mean. <laughs> Fizzing, you know what I'm Fizzing. saying. DC, DC, know what I'm talking about. <laughs> Bay Area. Uh, and uh, we got a special deal for our listeners. You try Bluetooth free when you use the promo code issues, issues. at checkout. You just pay five dollars for shipping. That's it. So Bluetooth.com promo code issues. issues. You receive your first month free, mm. and you mm. just pay five dollars for shipping. That's five dollars to get it. When out. y'all trying Bluetooth, man? Hey, right, let's do a Bluetooth party. You tried it. No, no, not yet. We all just I gotta order. hang out. Hey, everybody should y'all been order ordering one. it for like two years now. Um, when y'all gonna pull? I took one this morning. It's my, it's my anniversary today, <laughs> so <laughs> yeah. You gonna pop it? Well, you gonna get it? Well, today? next week we'll be out, so I guess I'll bring the whole pop package. Uh, Don't even tell her either. Just pop next it. week, you got some? Uh, no, I might get some. Quickly, Keon got my plug. I, got, I, got, I don't I got know about that. I like the Blue Chew party. We should have all our followers get Blue Chew and meet us somewhere. Okay, <laughs> smash us. I don't know about no, no, not smash us. Oh, slow down, party. We just all walk around with directions. <laughs> yeah, what do you say on? What do you say on? Let's uh, see if it works, Chris. Uh, Super Trooper, he was like, "Listen, I'm a couple. long time listener." <laughs> and issue tickets with mega huge bars. <laughs> the Blue Chew. Why? Why? I think it's an in smash us. I can see the comments. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, just have a good time, you know. <laughs> no yeah. circle jerk. Just hang out with each other. Yeah, I mean, it wouldn't be hang bad. Out. Just hang out. Like, playing wolf. Yeah. Playing Plan wolf. Working it's a straight there, stiff. Man. I think you did it. You, you too excited. <laughs> <laughs> this is not me. It's the chew. No. <laughs> it's not me. It's the chew. <laughs> That was uh, the werewolf okay. reference. Oh, that, that, that was that was the werewolf. soul. That was the werewolf. Ah. I look Tony blinking out here, bro. <laughs> Oh, we getting uh, changed and shit? Yeah, I got this for the uh, Serene thing I wear. Okay. Ah. Mm. Yeah. But now I got to get another piece. I saw the light uh, blind. I was like, ah, hey, that bling, that bling. <laughs> Clingage. Okay. Hey. I got it for that. So I got to wait for this other piece. Okay. Oh, I thought your it, thing was on. It was. It just the pieces, on. pieces. I was going to see if they were saying anything. Um, I mean, I guess I could log in myself. Talking. They ain't here talking. They chatting. What y'all have for My dinner last night? Dark. There you go. Last night was oh, Wagyu geez. Burgers. Oh, Wagyu. Ooh, yeah. Fancy, yeah. yeah, it was pretty good Ooh. with some... Uh, at a restaurant? No, not at the house. Oh. Yeah, yeah. We had bacon cheeseburgers with Wagyu and some... Uh, what's that bacon with the pepper on it? We made some... That was pretty, it was pretty oh, good. Uh, I can't think of it, but I know what you're talking yeah, about. Yeah, that shit was fire. Oh, okay. Yeah. I had a salad from Chop Stop. Oh, good. no, Chop Stop. I put everything oh, in that's that. That's an apple. Let me... Yeah, this more. No, they, they, no, they sell us this is bad, bro. Place. They put it in the bowl. It's an appetizer. And every day, I throw they everything chop in it there. up for you. I like yeah. the fact that they chop it up. They I chop it chop very well. Being big salads. It's good like salad. Good like, size salad. When big? does it not be a salad if you put like meat, spinach? Uh, it's still salad. All types of salad. salad. Yeah, modern food with no meat. No. I, I did all. I did some tofu in that bitch, and I did some uh, quinoa. Oh, no, I had I'm not a fan of quinoa. It don't taste like nothing. If like you cook, it, would you see them like cooking like, it. like maybe chicken broth or something like that? I never did. Yeah, okay. yeah, that's just fire. Maybe, maybe fire. What vegetable broth? Is? Mm-hmm. Vegetable broth. I would cook. Yeah, it. yeah it's better. The sodium in the vegetable broth. Oh, it'd be high as hell. Man, high. Man, that's sodium. But you can man. just season it like anything else or add stuff. Like, I don't eat quinoa by itself. I always add it. It's like when I make a vegetable mix, I put the quinoa in there. Yeah, it's good. So I just eat mixture. it all. Like last night, I had chicken, brown rice, and broccoli. And then I got hungry on the late night, so I had a quinoa and arugula salad. Hey, um, I was gonna say because that quinoa and broccoli looked like some fire yeah. ass weed. Yeah, I got hungry on the late night, had a salad. I wanted something else, but I was like, nah, I gotta. I'm still shredding up, so I was like, let me discipline real quick. Do the kids shred up when you shred up? 
Everybody. Uh, everybody. They don't understand that. I'll be by myself. They don't do I just did so much over the holidays. Oh, I was just like, all right, it's, it's over. I'm done. Did they start working out with you yet? Yeah. They do push ups for no reason. They do push ups for no reason. No reason. Dad, I'm going to get a workout. It's usually when it's time to go to bed. That's when they want to work out. No, now you want to work yeah. out. Yeah, Dad, let me get let me get a few push ups in. Let, uh-huh. me, let me do a few. Right. I'm like, push up in your skin. Go, go, <laughs> go ahead, yeah. son. Let's do them. Fun. And they like pull ups. Oh, word. They like the pull ups. I can pull-ups do three. Pull ups three hurting. Yeah. I can do hmm? three. Pull-ups We're going to have to take daddy pull-ups. issues to see all I of can this do stuff. three whole pull ups, guys. <laughs> three? Yeah, I, uh-huh. I went straight on. I got one of these. Yeah, you can do it all the way down. This way. No, oh, that's, that's a chin, chin up. up. Yeah, that's a chin oh, up. I can do three chin ups, guys. Three no, chin chin up. I can probably chin do ups two. A little I think easy. I did two of these because when I go to the yeah, park with Izzy, mm-hmm. I'll be doing them. Pull ups are tough, man. Yeah. Pull ups are not a fan. I want to learn how to do the pull up into a dip. I I, I, I I knew how to do that until I got fat. <laughs> <laughs> and I couldn't do it no more. But I can get like two of them. Like bartenders? Yeah, it's like the way you got to. Yeah, I see them. Yeah, yeah, I don't know how to do I it. I get stuck right here. <laughs> but I want to do one. <laughs> I get stuck looking at the bar. Right. <laughs> <laughs> I can't get. What are they called? The... Power ups or something like that? No, oh, no, I don't know. I've seen this joke, yeah. dude. I know the bartenders gym, like, used to do that. that. That's the name of the crew from uptown. They're in New York. They're all doing all crazy. Yeah, yeah. yeah they be doing wild. They used to do that at the bar. At, no, at the park. Oh, because they only work out in the bar. So oh. they, be, they do stuff like where they the hanging sideways. Yeah. Yeah, I'm like, bro, y'all core strength is insane. It's crazy. It's insane. But they be cheering each other on. <laughs> they got that. They got the team, man. <laughs> do, the do they get paid for it? I get if you make money off it. Now, Otherwise, I mean, they got, they you know, the you internet, I'm sure they make it. Yeah. 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 That yeah. is yeah. true. I think that they live a little true. longer from the health benefits. Yeah. Yeah. I'll right. be saying old cats doing that stuff. I seen Bruce Lee die in his prime, guys. What you didn't mean? see it. You heard about it. Well, but right. I didn't see it. But we know it happened. Core out the world. But the well, they said it was some speculations with Bruce. But you know, nope. I'm not here to <laughs> spread rumors. I don't know where you're going with this. Chess. It was just he had an incredible, incredible straight, incredible core. Doesn't make you live longer necessarily. It can. Though. Yeah. You don't know. <laughs> was the scientist <laughs> <and> doctor? <laughs> <right now. laughs> Bruce Lee had a dope body, bro. He did. Huh? Slender, that slender, that yeah. slender sleeve slender cut up. He had the wings. Yeah, Bruce. He was killing it. Crazy shape, bro. Yeah. Crazy he was dope, thing. man. He was quick. Oh, man. sweet. Man, that man, documentary I was like watching when he was demonstrating Blow the moves light. on random Blow TV water. producers. Blow <laughs> <light>. <laughs> <laughs> he was just standing right here. They was, they was flinching late. <laughs> yeah, they even knocked out. Man, right. they even <laughs> knocked out. <right. laughs> <laughs> like, man. This I follow this one dude. He's a uh, Wing Chun oh, instructor. Wow. That's what Bruce Lee studied, the Wing Chun. <laughs> and I, I'm watching him, like, his demonstrations with the class. Yeah. I'm like, bro, he smacked this dude five times in under a second. <laughs> He's like, <laughs> the dude was like, <laughs> get worked in the like, UFC Lord. today. Well, it's different. No, it's, it's fighting. Same. It, but it's different when you, it's like, it's like, it's different when you study a style to fight, right? Like, Boxing and wrestling are different, right? But Bruce Lee studied many styles. What, that's what, what his whole well, that's thing different. Was. But I'm talking about he's teaching Wing Chun specifically. You're like, well, I'm like, hopefully the dude isn't only doing that one thing in an MMA fight. No, Bruce Lee did multiple. Like he, he was the trained first one multiple. to train like an MMA fighter. Right, that's he trained saying. multiple. He would still get worked in today's MMA. Who Bruce Lee? Who Bruce Lee? Yeah, yeah. yeah. I know. Right. He, but he in would be training class? MMA. Yeah, uh, yeah. Based on George what? Based on, yeah. Give it to him. Wait, wait. But if he was what training you during though? this time, he would be training his MMA style though. and his skill set. Bruce Lee beat the it's referee like ass. Yeah, well, referees on everybody. the ref, ref, good fight. The ref, everybody in the ring. <laughs> anybody in the ring gonna get it. Like it's hard to say that stuff. Like even when people be like, oh, players back then versus now. Well, if they were growing up in an era where you do all the stuff they do now, who knows? Who knows? So oh, that's yeah. why I say with Bruce Lee because he's. A very uh, a unique specimen because he did all of those things, which the uh, the today's fighters does. He trained in all those different. So why are you arts. saying he would get work if he did all those things? Uh, it's just the build is different now. But he'd be in his own weight class. class different. But he would be an MMA fighter. He wouldn't. Yeah, yeah. yeah but he in would his train weight class. He MMA. wouldn't be fighting. How many times you see Bruce Lee get punched in his face in a movie? Period. <laughs> Even in the movies, they give him a backhand smack with. Oh, tsh. They never just like, ooh, take this knee, uh, ooh, <laughs> leg lock. Are oh, you saying he don't have a chin? You say he might not have a chin. He for don't it. have a chin. How we know? We ain't never seen I him just take said a punch. It. <laughs> <laughs> no, we've never seen him take a punch. Now in today's uh, movies, people take punches and stuff. He's like, oh, okay, it's pretty even. Bruce Lee ain't take no punch. 
He can hit him. And he grabbed weapons real quick, so you know he, he's so nice. He took kicks, though. <laughs> you talking about Bruce Chuck Lee, bro? Yeah. Craig is uh, crazy, crazy, right? Crazy, Green bro. kicked him. I like Green him. kicked him in the chest. <laughs> Whole foot. Footprint. <laughs> Long kicks. <laughs> His foot I get was the so name. big. Mm-hmm. I like Anderson Silva. I like GSP. I'm just giving them guys. Anderson, Anderson, man. Anderson was cold. Yeah, right. Anderson was man, cold. Man, them leg breaks. And, uh, I'll be like, yeah, uh-huh. yeah, I ain't a big UFC Shandy, man. Woo. Too gruesome, bro. I'll be watching it. I want to be a fan, but it just all come back to boxing for me. I yeah. prefer boxing. Me too. I don't know what it is. Because I respect more, it. Yeah. But it's just, give me boxing. MMA is just more, uh, like if I was to train, I would probably do MMA just because in real life, people ain't just going to box. Right. MMA reminds me of when you see two dudes fighting and then you want to see them fight and they just start holding each other. Yeah. Now we got to watch this shit on TV yeah. <laughs> until, the, until the round ends. You know what I mean? I'll be like, bro, yeah. fight. We want to see a fight. I hate it when they grapple. Yeah, when they grab yeah, and be like, yeah. yeah. That, I do not like the grapple part of MMA. When I be like, seeing a flying kick to the face, I'd be like, woo! Yeah, the, in the fun. beginning when they first start yeah. off, like, yeah, yeah, oh, this is separated. Right. Now I go back. But when they win. land on the ground for two minutes, yeah. I'm yeah. like, nah, I don't I care about Everything that. in MMA is what I used to be scared of in a fight and used to make me quit. Like, when you start fighting and they kick, you be like, oh, no, no, you kicking. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> when you go to the ground, you be like, oh, get us up, get us up. Right. No, let them back up, they let them back up. They do all that. Right. That's what I'm yeah. saying. For for street fights, it's more, it's better to train that. But for entertainment purposes, right. I don't want to see you laying on the ground for Me two neither. minutes. Mm-hmm. I, that's why I liked watching Anderson's fights, because he was knocking people out with in an assortment of ways. Yeah. So I was, I was a fan of that. But the grapples, the tap outs... I, mean, I respect like, uh, it though. Yeah, I Those mean, I respect. Great though. Oh, submission yeah. skills. Submission rain, some of it. Yeah, maybe. Very great, bro. The tap yeah. out. Oh yeah. You like? I'm a warrior. I'm like, ah, shit. Okay, okay, okay. <laughs> nah, fam. Those things are great. Who's the tap out when we was little? Now I know. Yeah. I watched a uh, preacher fight this weekend on his uh, mom's yeah. live. I talked to him yesterday about it. He, How did he uh, look? He looked good in that first round. Oh, he bro? ran out of gas. He said he shot his wide the first yeah. round. Okay. You know, how many rounds did he do? Three. Three. He did the full thing. Oh, he did three minute, three yeah. minute, three minute rounds. The second round was tough for him, but he hung in there. The comedian, but he didn't tap out. Uh-huh. Yeah, he been training for like two, two years now. But he wasn't supposed to fight that dude for he, what UFC or for boxing? M- MMA. Oh, okay. Yeah, but he uh, he was supposed to fight somebody else. They changed the venue like five times, changed the fighters a bunch of times because of COVID. Uh-huh. Mm-hmm. So the first the, when he showed the dude he showed me in Vegas, I was like you. I, I believe in you, but I'm, you gonna you gonna fight him? Like it was this big old. I was like, he ain't your he ain't your weight mm-hmm. class. Preacher's big pretty old, big himself. Nah, preacher's smaller than me. Really? He, when we first met Preacher, Preacher was jacked. Okay, and then you know he became vegan. He slimmed up, blah blah, blah this and that. But so now he's one seventy maybe. Oh damn! But the dude small? he was supposed to fight, I was like, I thought oh. he was vegan for years. Nah, and when no? we when we first he became vegan, probably like. Four, three, four years ago. Oh, was it an obvious like difference in the in the fight? Like, was the dude way more skilled? Or? Nah, it was like uh, that second round. You could just tell, you know, because preacher looked good in that first round. It was like, yo, preacher's round. But then second round, uh, you could just tell he's a little bit slower. And then once they started grappling and stuff, he was just getting them. Three then, minutes, but he hung in time. there. Yeah, yeah. yeah, but his mom, the preacher's mom, was stressing me out though because she was like emotional. Oh, he, he said she can't come. So we <laughs> was like, yo. <laughs> a lot of people, a lot of people had to turn it, turn the volume down. Yeah, he's killing my it was, baby. A, it was, a, it was yeah. that mom, you yeah. know, energy. So he it was, was just like, nah. like she was like, oh, it sounded like she was about to. <laughs> I was like, ah, it sounded like she was to this. <laughs> he said he was like, nah. She was. He said she was too mom. Yeah, she he's was like, mom. He's, like, sure. he's like, you know, she's like, get off my baby. He's like, what I'm gonna do? Say, mom, can you? He's like, that's my baby. Yeah. He's like, hey, excuse me, my mom doesn't like to. Could you, could you get off? You hear my mama? Get your hands yeah. off. He in a war Shut up right now. I whip her ass too. <laughs> and he said that's his brother was like hot. Like his brother was like, get up. Get up. Like slamming the table. Get off. He was like, they, they can't. Yeah, they can't. <laughs> they can't go. <laughs> All that's good if you could use that energy to win, he but if it you're still losing, like, does nothing. Yeah. If I hear my mom losing hope. <laughs> no, no, Tony. Oh God, no! I, I might be. I can't. That's, no. what made, that's what made Rocky so amazing. Adrian never believed in him. Man, he, 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 he won. We can win. 
Rocky, Rocky just had to take that in his home that I paid for by winning. You gonna tell me I can't win? It was great as you get that energy, you get that Hulk Hogan hand up, yeah. <laughs> and then you just drop. But you ever rewatch that stuff? Like when Hulk Hogan would just start powering up. It's so ridiculous. So it's man. comical. So I used big, to try that, and he would just—they would hit him. He would just. <laughs> <laughs> like no, <laughs> but as a kid, you was like, it was yeah. real. Yeah, it was real. Up. Yeah, Hulk, you, you're back, making him mad. I went back it was and always watched real. Crack right. it up. <laughs> Even though Preacher didn't know who fought him, I kind of, uh, I kind of like what COVID is doing with sports. Like uh, when you see the NBA. The matchups look strange as hell. So teams that are supposed to win are now losing. Because you don't know who you're playing. Yeah, it's just like Random boxing. people coming in. When you get on the team, man, I just got here yesterday. <laughs> it's like boxing. I think you should just show up and be like, oh, I'm fighting him? Oh, yeah. Right. Right. Let's get it. Right. That's nah. how they do it in the underground fight yeah. scenario. Oh, yeah. you know we get you 50 up. bucks for the win. <laughs> who am I fighting him? The goddamn werewolf right. come out. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, shit. <laughs> Straight from Russia. <laughs> Give you 10 bucks on the loss, 50 on the win. You're like, all right, let's do it. And you get this Seven dude. fights a night. Comes out like this. Yeah. Like, what style is this? Doing this. Yeah. Put them up. People used Hit to it. really do that. Put them up. Put them up. Put them up. Fight like that. I was doing boxing on the Oculus last night. Oh, uh, I've done it on there. I got to do it. This is a little app called Supernatural, and it's like, uh, it gives you like boxing maneuvers while mm -hmm. music is playing so you got the stuff is coming towards you so you got to do a hook or a jab mm -hmm. to the beat and you got to duck bob and weed tiffany haddish is one of the uh instructors they got different like instructors, oh, cool. and she was like giving like instruction on Man. one of them what did she was like tony right <laughs> <laughs> you can see me right yeah. here right now what the hell is this because it be, it's yeah. like you really somewhere else when you on the oculus yeah so it'd be like you'd be looking at them and they'd be in the desert in front of some pyramids Talking to you, and then let's try it. And then you go in, and I'll be sweating. Oh, it's a real, you get a real workout. Oh, yeah. hell yeah. Tough. Mm -hmm. There's a lightsaber one on there. When things are coming at you, you get to swat it with the lightsaber. Mm -hmm. right. Are you in the Oculus fam now, Oh, too? yeah, I'm in there now. Oh, yeah, okay. I, I tried Chaz's own. Yeah. Oh, I thought you got one, too. No, I, mean, no, no, I just tried somebody else. I can't yeah. afford that, yeah. It's dope. Then no, I did a boxing cheaper. match on the yeah, they like thrill of the fight game. Mm -hmm. How was that? I, haven't done that I won yet. that with TKO yeah. with that, in that joint. But I'll be tired, man. Y'all see the dude that got knocked out? On the Oculus? I yes. seen the dude knock oh, the kid out. Who I saw the guy who punched the kid, too. <laughs> he was like, ooh. <laughs> he fell. He, he fell no, down. I seen that. But this dude got knocked out from the game. Yeah, like he was, he was in the game. You see him... You see him scared when they touch gloves anyway. Like, he flinches, and then he goes like this, and then he just, fall, yeah. <laughs> he just falls down. I'm like, you didn't really get hit, bro. Yeah, he did. <laughs> he saw all that. Saw, oh. That's the next level. Mm. Right. Where you can feel the hits. Mm. That's going to be the next level. Bro, how, you, do you want, like, video games... I'm like, y'all don't want to feel getting shot. I God, want, shit. I wanted to feel a little something. Like a little shock. This is good. Yeah. 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 That changed the way you play. Yeah. Like everybody right, be like, yeah. you're a camper, bro. Right. And then if you feel it, everybody going to be camping. <laughs> <laughs> everybody going to be in the bushes, laid out, crawling. It won't be as much shit talking either. They're like, nah. hey, I think it, ah! <laughs> <laughs> I'm pretty sure that's coming. They're going oh, to give you some sort definitely. of little vest or something. Mm -hmm. bro, the, way, the way stuff is now, even these controllers, bro, this PS5 controller is crazy. Like, just the 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 response back that you get. I need to PS5, too? Oh, yeah. Oh, dang. Chaz, I'm in the future, future bro. Man. I didn't I'm know in the future, PS5. bro. I thought Chaz, that was... Yeah. I'm about to be in the metaverse, bro. I'm in the future, dog. Mm. I'm not living with That's you That's when you really feel like the future is here. I'm in, I'm in the future, stuff man. Stuff like that, you be like, yo, <laughs> this is back to the future, Have too. you watched just Netflix on your Oculus yet? Yeah. Or YouTube? Uh huh? Bro, it's crazy. I was just telling you about this four years ago, Chad. Yeah, you did. You've been saying Hey, Craig. Craig, you were right about the air fryer. You're only wrong about music. I'm not. I'm not. I'm right about music. You're not. But. Huh? Wait, what? DC? I went to DC. I see all the doors. Oh, you know the doors. The doors behind me, Craig done been off. That's why I want to ride nowhere with Craig, little kid. Really? Because music going to be. I know it's going to be some trash in this car. He's going to be all excited. Craig like, the I'll take it. No, I'm good. <laughs> Craig, I'll meet you there. Craig grew up in the greatest hip hop era, bro, and we just loves He was like, man, garbage. forget all this. <laughs> and loves not garbage. garbage. It's all good music. It's not all Andy good music. And he's from the East Coast. He's from What's New York. He's from the Mecca. Name one You'll never hear bad. Craig be like, uh, Mob Deep, or never. Eric uh, being Rock Him, he go. I'm new the... music. I, I did all that. I like all that. I could go he only liked classics. it when it was new, but now favorite you know song of all time, Symphony. 
Okay. Marley Mall, come on, stop playing with me. I'm take you back to. Every, you don't even know that song. I know and, damn and, well and, you and, don't. I know. But, and that's the thing about Craig. <laughs> Why? Because he did the slow dollar. Yeah, you know. don't know. <laughs> I, I, didn't, I, didn't, I, didn't, I was like, <laughs> DC was familiar. But what symphony? Which one? Do, 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 do. Oh, okay. Do, 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 do. They was killing on that. Yeah. Big Daddy Kane yeah. was on there. Yeah. Big Daddy Kane. Nah, Kumo man. D. Mike for the Simpsons. <laughs> Kumo D name. wasn't on there. He's going to hear everybody from that. <laughs> Moni Love. No, no. <laughs> Moni <laughs> Love. You made them all. Ah. Queen Latifah was, was on, on there. Buddy. That nah, was on Buddy. His name is old Who was on Symphony? Now. Y'all name who was on Symphony? Big Daddy Kane. Cool G uh, Rap. Cool G Rap. Cool G Rap. Master Ace. Master Ace. Wait. My echo changed voices. What the we sang it together, bro. <laughs> <laughs> Craig G. 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 Mike, Mike Geronimo Mike was on there. Geronimo. No, he wasn't on there. <laughs> you know what? I'm, I'm not going to talk about it no more. I don't want to talk about it. I was impressed that you knew Mike Geronimo, though. I'll give you oh, that. Oh, yeah. Mike Geronimo, bro. I was like, what? You don't know Mike Geronimo. He knew about Mike Geronimo. Yeah. I found out on the road. He was hella impressed. Okay. He was like, yeah, what? I was like, what you know about Mike Geronimo? <laughs> I was super excited. Cause not a lot of people know. I would play a I special playlist for you, Tony. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, I, I pull it. Cause Craig knows good music. He was talking the other day, and I was like, "I bring my three times him. dope out for you. Three times we'll dope. We'll sing it together. Yeah. I'll make it weak in the knees. Man, three times <laughs> dope. <laughs> what was that song they had? Uh, the dividends. Funky that was my dividends. Joint. Yeah, funky dividends. But then Craig would be like, "Y'all got this hot <laughs> track. <laughs> Since you looked oh, at no. me, I'ma keep looking <laughs> at you." <laughs> Greg just bring out music song like somebody just dumped out the garbage can in the back. <laughs> Craig be like, y'all like that? I got classics. Man. That's that new uh, shit. Uh-uh. I raised my kids on music, man. I used to make them listen to different gen- uh, different decades every day while they did homework. That's good. You get that's good. Yeah, you know, that's TV. Get all all music. decades. Yeah. Give them, give them What's your favorite decades? A rap? Oh, I, music. Go, I like the 70s. Yeah, me, oh, music, 70s. I but go, rap. No, give me your top three. Top three decades? Yeah. 70s, 80s. The 20s? The 1870s. The 60s. Rag time. Let's see. The 70s is number one. I'm going 70s first. Um, I'm going 80s right after that. I'm going 90s next. I need my Luther. I need my Man, Regina the 80s was Beth. cracking, Luke. I need, man. I'm going 90s next after 70s. I have this is it's not. I guess it's a nineties two thousand. I'm trying to go ninety five to two thousand five. I would do nineties, nah, but nineties is the seventies because I know. But I had like that's why I like <laughs> the Drew Hills and some stuff. Oh no, man, you crossed the decade. Yeah, well, I'm sorry, man. That's Drew Hill was nineties. Well, he was late. Like, but then I was they like, were, they were nineties. Yeah, they were nineties. Late nineties. You can't were 90s. cross I like the decade. Eight. <laughs> you still Drew Hill was ninety seven. Most people you like from the two thousand still started in the nineties. No doubt. No doubt. No doubt. You look defeated. 90, no, I'm not defeated. I'm just thinking. <laughs> 70s, uh, 90s. No, because 90s was, you know. So 70s? So. Uh, 70s, 80s, and 10s. 2010, yeah. those, those are 10s. Come on now. Yeah. I feel that. Uh, I'm going to have to go with the 90s. Oh, uh, 70s, second? 90s, yeah. Mm-hmm. That's the 70s again. The huh? 90s, all nah, they did then was they did the new Jack Swing. Yeah, I mean, they changed okay. it. Okay. Well, know they know did that. do a lot of sampling from the yeah, 70s. I'll That's why the that. 70s I'll give you that. Crown King. Yeah. But the 90s, though, so many classic hip hop albums from that era that I love. Um, so it got to be the 90s. And then, uh, I feel like it might be the 10s, man. Because I feel like I don't go back to the, two th- the, the early cent, 2000s ja a lot. That's the early 2000s, Nelly? right? When you say Nelly. the 10s, you mean who Who do you got? 10s and up, so Kendrick, J. Kendrick, Cole, J. Cole and Nas Kanye. was dropping fire in the 10s. Kanye. Jay-Z. Mm-hmm. Um, well, Jay-Z go back to the 90s. Big Crit. You got a lot of dopeness in the in the 10s and up. Yeah, it is. Um, Hip-hop-wise, yeah. Because the 2000s, I'd be, I be more you know, nitpicking. In the 2000s, mm-hmm. of course, I listen to Jay and, and Nas from the 2000s, but uh, Kanye, they got really kicking on the tens. Oh, Kanye did. Ti, Kanye did debut in the oh, early. Ti, mm, yeah, they all did. Dang, hmm. Yeah, some. Uh, I want to go. I want to say 60s, things. but I don't really Jeezy? like. To I like Motown. That's. Well, yeah. 70s, yeah. That's 60s, I be, I be liking some, 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 like some white stuff in the 60s, too. Though. All my white stuff, oh, most of my white stuff it's comes from the 80s. It's some good rock in the 60s, man. Bee Gees was yeah, 60s. 80s, 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 80s rock, for sure. Yeah. No, I said Bee Gees. That's 70s. 70s. Yeah, yeah 70s. that's 70s. Mama's in the Poppers was 60s. 
That might well, be late sixties, right there. Okay. You know what's crazy about the Beatles? I don't like them. I like when <laughs> when people sample them. Mm-hmm. I feel like the samples are always better than what the Beatles did. I'm which, but <clears throat> the Beatles did it first. But the samples are always better. I can't, I can't name you I can't a agree. Beatles album. Like, I can't, Me neither. I can't. I, when I, I hear the Beatles you know, a lot. I don't. You like them a lot? Yeah. I don't. Uh, I, if you say it, and I'm like, oh, When I hear people cover their songs, and I go back and listen to the Beatles version of it, the cover always better. It's always better. I don't, I, don't, I really don't. I can't. I can't be like, yo, you know this track by the Beatles. I had to hear it, and then you'd have to say, well, uh, that's the Beatles song. So there's gonna be right. a lot. If you listen to it, a lot of them would be because like, I, I have I have Queen over the Beatles. Oh, cool. Yeah. I, can, yeah. I can respect yeah. that. Yeah. Easy yeah, work. Sure. Yeah. Okay. You have people over people, but the Beatles is yeah, like I, I recognize more Queen music. Right. Like I get the Beatles, the Beatles credit because I don't know if you so do. many people sample. I them. do. Name two songs, DC. We will rock you. <laughs> nice. Besides the sports anthems, I think if you went, <laughs> Besides, I mean, <laughs> that's a good I one. think if we came to you with songs from each group, you would probably know more Beatles songs. No, of course not. I don't mm. think you know their Beatles songs. That's what I'm saying. That's like, what I'm saying. The Beatles, yeah. the music, and like it just wasn't as like it didn't hit as hard as Queen music hit to me. I, but I agree but with the that. Beatles hey, music Mur- is literally all over the place. Yeah. Yeah. Give me like their main song that, that Freddie Mercury we, we top would just hear. five all time singer to me. Absolutely. Right. So that, his voice that is, is that incredible. Is, yeah, Queen yeah. is easily better. I than like the Beatles Queen way better than the Beatles. Yeah, I just don't hear, I just, like if I hear the, a Beatles song, I would be like, "Oh, that's the Beatles." Yeah, I was, I, you, you would have to tell me it's a Beatles song, right? Oh, that's the yeah. Beatles. Like I, I, I learned it later. Like I'd be listening to like Boys to Men or ran, and like, ran, just random people, and I'm like, "This is a Beatles." That, song? That's why I'm saying you would probably know, you know more Beatles the road, songs. Give me a Beatles song. No, but uh, I that's like that we would know that you would know. Yesterday, oh. That's a good one. What did you say yesterday? <laughs> Twist and Shout. But I don't think that was a Beatles original. I think someone else did that. And they Maybe. T- What's his name did that? Twist thought. and Shout. Chuck I think Barry. that was a... Uh, nah. I thought uh, Isley did that. Yeah. Then they oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. yeah. You're right. You're right. Yeah. Yeah. It's the Isley Brothers. My I'm bad. giving right. that credit to the white man. <laughs> 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 yeah. That's, that's right. I want to hold your hand. I want to hold mm. your hand. You knew yeah. that. Yeah. I know that one. Yeah. Yesterday. Yesterday. Uh, but see, you, but you think you think of the Boys and Men version or you think of Beatles? I think of the Beatles. I think of the Beatles version. I think of the Boys and Men. The yeah. Boys, well, the Boys and Men did it way better. Oh, they so could think it. Yeah. A lot of people can do it way better right. because they can't really. They're not strong vocalists. Right. They weren't strong even. They also like, had years to perfect it. Even when he when yeah. like Beatles uh, did a lot in a short amount of time. That's what people yeah. lose you, sight of. I will give they you. They just named two. You just named two yeah. that I that came right to me. So yeah. you would know. Uh, they were technically my guitar, a boy band. My guitar. Huh? They were technically a boy band. Yeah, broke up the first boy band. But they could play instruments. Yeah, but even when you like even. Musically, they they weren't the best at anything. They just did a lot. Like they were like Jack in a Box. They just did a lot of stuff. Like they they weren't the goat. <laughs> right. at I like anything, the curly you know fries. I mean? Yeah, you like, you like there's a lot of stuff. <laughs> and the fajitas. But then somebody <laughs> always does it better. They just did everything. But it's mm-hmm. like even when when uh, what's his name was going in on him, uh, uh, Quincy. Quincy was <clears> like <throat> on the drums. Piano. They were average. I knew way better people, but they just right. Yeah, you know I mean, he was like they—they they weren't the best drummers, they weren't the best guitarists, they weren't the best vocalists, they weren't, but they just did a lot of stuff. So I got to give them their credit because they did a lot of stuff, Quincy but they weren't was also the best. Hard on people after touring oh, yeah. with Frank Sinatra, he's yeah. like, yeah, they ain't got nothing. <laughs> right, right, right. <laughs> I, I just look at the catalog and, the, and the the how much we hear it and how right. long it's lasted. This is like impressive. Beatles is. Numbers Eternal. wise, who who did better numbers, Queen or the Beatles? The Beatles is the top selling yeah. music Woo. act of all time. Yeah, all time. Jeez. He's sitting right at the top. Numbers don't lie. Yeah. And it, it's just like when, when Billboard put out a, a top 10 list of the best selling, the best, the top 10 artists of Billboard. Uh-huh. And the Beatles was like number one. And people was just like, man, this list is garbage. It's bogus. I'm like, man, it's, it's all numbers, y'all. It's right. all charts. Relax. Wait, I, the, the thing I saw wasn't a numbers chart. It was. A, it's a Billboard chart. Where and you talking about the list that had the Beatles, and Rihanna, like and yeah, yeah. Madonna? And mm-hmm. I thought that was a who's good chart. No, no, no. It's a Billboard chart of the top ten artists of all time. See, they it's didn't say Billboard. when you look at the even the article, it didn't say that. So yeah. I see why people got because I was looking at it like, what, what, what is this based on? That's what. That's and why it I said say Billboard it. magazines at top. And once to say Billboard, what we counted, they're talking about the charts. So yeah, people see, just, just said, immediately was like, no, nah, they was uh-uh. like top ten artists, and people was like, what? Yeah, like cause it was like just basically like two black people, people went like, straight nah, to the emotions. It was more black people in there. It was Michael, Rihanna, Rihanna, Michael, Michael, Michael Janet, Janet, and uh, it was somebody else black on there. Stevie Wonder, four oh, out Stevie. of ten, no Prince on there. Nah, nah. Prince wasn't. No but uh, like Madonna and the Beatles are like 
one and two, I think. And people were like, Madonna, what the f-? Madonna like, got hey, some classics. I think Mariah Carey was huge. Oh, yeah, yeah. Yeah, That's what like, people don't realize, man. Hits. You know how many Madonna times I seen Desperately hits. Seeking Susan? <laughs> <laughs> Get into the groove. I remember man. all the Madonna parodies oh, growing up, bro. Well, because she had the cone titties. That's well, she did everything. Yeah. She deep throated a bottle. I'm mad that she got a fake booty, man. She ain't had to do that. What was that Madonna song, If You Live to Tell? That was a beautiful song. She got some good songs. Yeah. I don't even remember her music, really. She well, got walking with a, no, walking like a with version a was uh, LL Cool J, cool J, cool J, but cool J. she had a panther just following like a her. And, just like a prayer. Vogue. Oh, yeah. I gotta, I'd have to go back. I don't oh, remember. Man. Stop playing. Oh, yeah, Let's yeah, get yeah, to yeah, it. Yeah. <laughs> Cherish. I'm, I remember her most <laughs> from League of Their Own <laughs> and Dick Tracy. And the movies. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> the movies. Yeah, like her music, I don't really know. And Madonna was able to hang in there, too. Yeah. She had hits well into the 2000s. Yeah. I think she still got some hits. That's why I be telling people, like, she ever did the verses. She's smoking. Oh, she beating mm-hmm. anybody she ass. beating the brakes off a lot of people. Oh, yeah. Tough. But I think Mariah might have been on that list, too. Probably. She didn't have one selling female artists. You know right? what? I give a lot of uh, Cindy Warren? Lauper songs to Madonna in my head. I'd be like, was that Madonna or Cindy Lauper? <laughs> Cindy Lauper had Girls Just Want to Have Fun, yeah, Cindy True had that Colors. Voice. Cindy had some fire, too, though. Time after time after time. Know that's, that's, Captain Captain that's a beautiful song. Yeah, Captain Super Lou dope. brought me to her. I watched uh, the Mass Singer, the uh-huh. first season of it. We just sat there and binged. And uh, Gladys Knight was one of the ones in disguise. Uh-huh. She sang time after time. Oh, that's a beautiful song. Yeah, I like that song. Yeah, yeah. it's a good song. 80s was cracking. 80s, yeah, the got 80s some I told you. 80s was 80s my got some fire. Know, yeah, bro. 80s was far as a. But the reason I gave 90s the edge was because. That's when I started buying my own music and coming into my own rather than just absorbing what was on. Because, mm. you know, music hit different when you get it yourself and you bought it yourself and then you play it and then your little whip. That's when it hit. <laughs> what, hit was the first, what was the first cassette you ever bought? Tom Petty and the Heartbreakers. Ah. Full Moon Fever. That's the, the album that had uh, Free Falling yeah. on there. Nice and smooth. Hip hop freaks. <laughs> <laughs> Mine's was uh, the first Ghetto Boys album, I oh. think. Was Gangsta Love on there? No, the one with Mine's playing tricks on me. Oh, okay, okay. Yeah. yeah. That was my first one I went and bought. Is that uh that's not the one with it's Bushwick Bill on the on the gurney? Yeah, that's the one. Okay. That was the first one I bought. And I was like, like, we can't be stopped. That's okay. the name of it. How'd yeah. you buy it? Were they were they, were there parental advisory then? I mean, my dad wasn't like a stickler like that. Oh, okay. He was already listening. He was probably listening to it. <laughs> oh, I thought you said like you just went. No, that's and got the first it. one I went myself yeah. and, bought, and bought. Okay. I was talking about that my, song the other day. Mine's playing tricks on that. That was the first time rappers felt human to me. What you mean? Because they were paranoid about. Oh. Everything they were doing, everything the rappers like glorify, they showed us the paranoia side of it, yeah. like the real side. I was just like, yo, I ain't never heard nothing like this right. at that time. I'm sure there might have been some tracks. It was, it was a creepy video. It was super creepy, mm, yeah. but it was like the storytelling and the mm-hmm. visuals they created. I was like, man, I ain't never heard nothing like this. I this randomly heard incredible. on my block yesterday, it was like, yo, I forgot man. about this. Scarface was like, Oh, you talking about my block? Yeah. Boom, it came boom, up never boom, out of nowhere. I was boom, like, boom, oh, my block. Dude, that's crazy. I like, hey. I like. I was listening to Willie D when they first came out. Willie D, Willie the gangster D. love. Yeah. Some of my friends sell drugs. I remember, <laughs> I remember that bar. <laughs> uh, I think mine was uh, Home Base by Fresh Prince and DJ Desi Jazz. Okay. Of course it of course was, it Chaz. Was. Yeah. Trash. What are you talking about, <laughs> bro? see Chaz great all excited. Album. Summertime was on there, though. Come on, great oh, album, yeah. bro. He didn't even like that song. What are you talking about? <laughs> he probably, <laughs> he probably didn't like it. DC yeah, yeah, like yeah, yeah, I didn't like it. Oh, you my did? God. At the beginning. Oh. Shut your ass up, DC. You no. be like, summer, summer, summer. No, summertime. at the beginning, it was dope, bro. But I, I, the summertime. summer anthem I liked better was the LBC one. Summertime. Summertime. Like, if I had to, yeah. Ooh, I never got tired of that song. <laughs> you got tired of summertime? I got tired of summertime. Ooh, had a nerd to be a judge and credit. Summertime. You know? That's better than, than that summertime. That shit was trash. Oh, I just not, wanted bro. to lead you up. So it's, I can not. <laughs> it's not better than summertime. How do you hate summertime? Okay, I like summertime by Will Smith. No. I, I liked mm-hmm. it. Tony, I liked it. I liked it. <laughs> That's one of the greatest hip hop songs summertime. ever. Summertime. And he painted, he painted Ooh, summer summertime. so perfect. Yes. We liked it, bro. I, I liked it. Nah, man. I liked up, it, bro. Tony. Yeah, man. Summer this is DC's time. last episode. DC the opposite of Craig. Craig likes everything new, and DC, like, it's too much. I don't like it. Anything that's cracking. He's like, yeah, it's too DC's much like, in nah, the head. They didn't play that too much for y'all. Hell honest. no. Oh, yeah. Because we so wanted So in the winter time, you like the song. Yeah. When it was winter yes. time, you like summertime. It's getting you ready for summer. Right. Here's summertime. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> 
Bro, the party? I, I, said, I didn't say it's the bad song. I just said it's yeah. Asian nah, man, look out. Man. That song is cracking, else. bro. I don't want to hear greatest. nothing else. This is a good song. Summertime is just Will Smith's underappreciated in hip hop, bro. I'm saying that now. You say what? Will Smith's underappreciated in hip hop. Right, also, I got, a, I got a question. Oh, uh, oh, 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 questions, questions. We have questions with D. C. Irvin. Hmm. Oh, that's excellent. Mm. Yeah, I like that remix. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Like, you gotta get it. You trying to make it sexy? Wait, wait, yeah. stop chasing. Stop chasing. We didn't play. Wait, wait, time out. The last time I did something different, you guys liked it. Well, maybe we didn't play. Well, hold on. Just get consistent, bro. Don't start. Don't start changing it every week. I'm not gonna try to change it every week. Can we go back to the original? Right. Wait, wait. The last week you guys were like, "Oh, we think we like that one more, right?" Did you guys not say that last time? Take that. Take that. Yes, exactly. Take that. Take that. Shit. Even the earth. Even the home was different. Yeah. Everything was different. He uh-huh. slowed it down. He spaced it out. I think he out. was stuck in summertime, though, because he was like, oh, I was missing questions. This, but <laughs> questions. <laughs> questions with D.C. Irvin. School is out, and it's sort of a bus. <laughs> <laughs> like, he, he didn't get out. Really he just did a lot, bro. Get out. <laughs> I actually did the minimum, which wasn't a lot. <laughs> every no every other time, it's like, ugh, ugh, ugh. Yeah, that's, that's what's that's that's okay, exciting. Which is fine, which is fine. I did something different. You guys didn't like it? Oh, no. no. <laughs> okay, I get, I'm, I'm well aware that you guys didn't like this one. I, I understand. Can you type no? <laughs> I just don't understand. understand. It just took the steam out the question for it me, did. bro. Like, yeah. it like, First off, it's probably a trash question anyway. <laughs> wow. I'm about to find out. Wow. <laughs> I thought you was going to go there with the mic, come back Man, with it. I don't want this shit. Well, I did a sophisticated version. Of course, you guys wouldn't like that, peasants. I'm heard. sorry. <laughs> It's like a jazz beat <laughs> behind that. What the heck? <laughs> Questions. <laughs> DC Irvin. Nah. Mm-hmm. Questions. All right. Yeah. Yeah. That's what it is. Bro, your, fav- your favorite neighbor. You love this guy. He's your mm-hmm. favorite neighbor. Well, you love this true. guy to death. He's been your neighbor for about 10 years. Mm-hmm. Kind of really good friends, right? Mm-hmm. Yeah. Uh, you realize one night you're watching him pulling a Brinks truck into his garage. Oh. Ben, okay. Ben <laughs> Sneaky pulling okay. a Brinks truck into his garage, <laughs> right? Uh. Next day on the news, you see that a Brinks truck was uh, came up missing. Mm-hmm. They're offering a million dollar reward for that Brinks truck. Ooh. There's five hundred thousand on that Brinks truck, but they're offering you a million dollars if you can turn, if you would turn in your neighbor, or whatever. You notice that your neighbor starts changing. He doesn't talk to you anymore. Oh. He's starting to become a <laughs> little bit of a dick. Uh, block- <laughs> <laughs> blocking you in. Little stuff, you know. You, the relationship has changed. Yeah. Are you snitching on him? <laughs> <laughs> How much? <are> you? <laughs> yeah. A million dollars. It's a million yeah. dollars. Yeah, he pissed in my rose bushes. <laughs> <Yes>. Was he... <laughs> Did he change before the heist? No, he changed as soon as he got there. As soon as you seen that Brinks truck pulling in, you start noticing the difference. So he changed in a day, though? Because if it's on the news that the truck is missing, he just, just in did general, it. Or just in general. You know, you so know how long has he been changed? That's what I'm saying. Like, okay. Just... Oh, okay. So we're going to say he's changed for about, about two months. So no, since he started planning two months. It. He's had the truck. He's been at the truck. The truck's just sitting in there. Oh, but when did they put the reward out? The reward came two out. Two months later? Two months later. You see it later. He's changed ever since then. Though. But you never talked to him about a truck or anything like that. Well, one, uh, when I first seen the Brinks truck, you know, you got to call the homies up. Uh, <laughs> we going to flock that house that night. <laughs> and then when we hear about it, we going to tell on them, too. <laughs> Dang. We I figured in two up. months he didn't spent more money than he's going to. Yeah, I'm telling. <laughs> you right. If he, if he being a dick to me, yeah, I'm telling. I don't think I'm telling. I'm telling. Yeah, if I'm not snitching. Because I know the highest changes you. You know what I'm saying? Once you do a, a high level crime like that, you're gonna be acting different. Yeah. So I'm gonna just give them grace on them. Be like, I know you stressed out about the heist. <laughs> <laughs> you gonna let them know you know? Danny you said we, you you said we were good friends though, like really. You can't good. let them know you know, know bro. All right. Y'all ain't that no, good no, friends if you ain't bringing no money. I feel like, I feel like, how the heist go? Right, go ahead, go ahead. This this you're not inter- telling them. This is I'm not you're... telling them. This is me thinking. Like, okay. That's why he been acting different because. Oh, he's a straight criminal now. He's a high level mm. criminal. So, all right, I'm gonna I'm I'm let you slide a little bit. But uh, I'm like, mind my business. Mm, okay. This is why I'm gonna feel weird, right? You said we was good friends 10, 12 years. Right. We're good friends. That means he come over, I come over, yada, yada. He know I got cameras. Nigga, you know I saw that truck. Right. Mm. You know I saw that <laughs> truck. I'm involved now. <laughs> so, you want your cut. Break me you up, bro. <laughs> you, or, know, you know I saw the truck. Or he could kill you. 
You well, he's not I breaking you off. That's not an option. That's the thing, bro. You snitch. How close are we if you hit a lick and didn't tell me? And didn't me. tell me, and I'm your guy? <laughs> then you come and back you with all the money? And you going to bring the truck in on I mean, my camera? New, no block party? I wouldn't no tell nobody. Watching it? His new boat wait, wait, blocking but your, your driveway. But your bank robber guy is different. <laughs> like, hey, what's up, man? Come on over and watch the game. Hey, we're about to do this heist. Those are different <laughs> levels. <laughs> yeah, if we friends like that, if you're like, hey, man, I don't I don't think we tight, tight. He just said we just good friends. You know some neighbors you don't talk to, you do talk to? You talk to them. You're good friends. But the neighbors that we talk to like growing up like they were our friends huh, like, that's kids was different then, yeah though. you know what I mean you ain't got no friends now. neighbors now you be like hmm. just neighbors. when I see him out in public I be like I don't know him yeah that nigga never talk to my neighbors in public I don't know my neighbors the, the new neighbors I don't know nobody well, you just got there yeah <laughs> but like my at the old spot I knew the the, the older couple over I got to know them okay because I you know I you know their out. name uh-huh. uh, I don't know their name I know their son's name his name is Tony but uh, I don't know their Convenience. names. Okay. I know my neighbors that, you know, their daughter and Keelan are in the same class. So, you, Ka- yeah. Cotty worked out with bond, the mom. Yeah. You know, we talked. They they put it, they put gave us a scoop on the neighborhood. Who the, who you talking about where. your new neighbors? Yeah. Okay. They, this person over here, blah, 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 blah. Like, my neighbors who live next to me, I don't, the one to the left, I don't fuck with them. It's called community. And then, but the ones to the right, they cool. But the ones behind us, they in the same class. And then... We kind of find out, like, you know, a couple of his classmates live around. So we got to get to know the parents. Mm. Mm. So, they, like, Keelan and, and they be talking to each other in the backyard. I was thinking about giving oh, them like walkie-talkies. The like, uh, like, what are you doing? Can you come over? <laughs> like, blah, blah, Because they, they got Wilson. a two-story. So they be looking. When he on the trampoline, they be like, what are you doing? Every time he gets home and prove Hey! Home and prove What are you doing over there? All right. You ready? But I did get to know my neighbors before I moved. There's, like, two... Neighbors, a little bit younger than us, black girl and white girl, all right, roommates. Then. Oh, okay. so we got to know them. They, would, they would watch the cats and stuff. Oh, okay. Yeah, but you knew their names. I, f- I forget everybody's <laughs> name. <laughs> <laughs> yes, yes. They, uh, their names was Tony and uh, Tony. Yeah. Tony, 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 somebody sixty times and not remember their name. Yeah. Uh, what I'm doing is not ratting. It's called a power move. What you doing? Uh, I told you I'm calling the homies. We gonna go over there. Seen some money drop out the, the truck. We gonna get them, then we gonna call the cops and be like, "Yeah, so you, damn, so you gonna rob, rob him and then call the cops on him? Yeah. Double, you double up, bro. <laughs> <Right>. Jesus <laughs> Christ, <laughs> Christ. <laughs> it's called hustling. <laughs> double. Craig, a real nigga from New York. <laughs> I'm like, cause if you, if he know, you know he got the money, then you, you might catch a bullet. We gonna rob him, then snitch him out. Yeah, sure. Get that million dollars. And I feel reward. like, I feel like, he if he done did. took a truck. Two months ago. That, nobody knows he has it? No one knows he has it but you. It's the perfect heist. Man, this is the perfect heist. Oh, yeah. He did, he did so you got to wait. So honestly, I'm going to be happy for him that he got away. Nobody knows. Right. But my nigga, come on, bro. You just got to bring a hard times. Hey, how you doing, man? <laughs> now I get it's hard for everybody. I just lost my job, too. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, we're probably going to have to move out of here. Uh, That's crazy. And you never know. <laughs> That's crazy. Look, 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 best of luck. Look, 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 right. like, you never know who's going to be moving in that might see things that might snitch. Yeah, yeah. That's, That's crazy. crazy. So That's you probably crazy. want me to stay here, but... I can't yeah, afford I mean, the baby's medicine anymore. Because, right. you know, I, I get to see who what's coming in, what's coming out. Yeah. Yeah, you know, Good so. luck. I'm starting to so feel like you got to break me off something, bro. You got to break me. If I'm your guy and I see... You got to break me off a little bit. Just a little something. What you, what you Wet gonna, my beak, baby. Wait, what are you going to go yeah. ask? What are you going to say to him? You're going to go like, hey, just I said. But I, but I feel like <laughs> I'm scared if I bring it up, I'm going to get killed. He's going right. to kill you. I, I, at this point, I, I know he's capable of anything. If you, can rob, if you can rob a, a heist like that, you could possibly kill somebody that knows too much. I'm going to literally do nothing. Hey, I liked you, Tony, but nah, I got to yeah. nah, kill Because I feel like he would have checked with me already, too. Like, hey, man, uh... The other day, did you see? <laughs> if he wanted to give me money, he would have broke me off months ago. But his parties are changing now. He's having fat parties. As long as I'm loud, you ain't oh, getting no sleep. All the way, he, parties, that's what I'm saying. Do you see that he's being addicted to us? Is no he, more invites. He's not inviting no. us to the party. Nah, you ain't see, that's what I'm saying. Oh. Yeah, he's changed, bro. He changed he's completely. He's a changed person, bro. He switched bro. up. Yeah, I'm still not snitching though. You still not right? Nah. He's changed, I don't want a bro. person like that in my neighborhood. Right. I got to get him. <laughs> <laughs> I thought we was. I don't just be like, man, you a hoe. I think yo. I'm ratting, bro. Rat to Tui. But I'm, I'm going to call him out like, why you ain't invite me to the party, man? You out here living lavishly. Look, you're going to get a million dollars. You can move out the neighborhood. You're going to get breaded, bro. A million? <laughs> nah. Because then I wouldn't, I wouldn't feel right with the money. He gone. Anyway, you don't, he don't even money. like you. Yeah, right. I don't know. He gone for now. It don't he ain't matter, doing life. Though. It's a power move. Ah, I just wouldn't. Brink's feel. truck, you doing life. No, you ain't doing life for a robbery. 
Brinks? You doing mad years. Right. You're doing mad years. You're doing five. You, you have to kill somebody. When you mess with the government money? Five I think you got to I think you got to. You getting out, though. You got to do a five to ten I don't know what, what kind of sense mm-hmm. you would get for Unless just you stealing people. the truck. You getting was it on Even robbery? if they gave you 20 years, if you don't kill nobody, I don't, I don't, think I don't you know how they got it, but they got okay. it. And you're doing a federal prison, so you, you're all right. He you, coming out looking for you, you snitch. You can have a get five in uh, federal prison. I'm a, I, I, I can't fine. do it. And visitations. Yeah. You gave me a PS5 so they, in prison. I'm gonna look up. You can look up times that people have done. I don't want that dude from the time got like invented. twenty One years. One dude got 168 months. Oh, so what is that? What's the math on that? Right. One dude. Years. One dude got that's nine like work. years. One yeah. of the dudes from the Lost that's like Boys, like 15 years or something, went to jail for robbery. Pretty not pretty Lou. It was a uh, Mr. Cheeks. 14 years. The, the one dude. Another one got uh, 96 months. Y'all remember yeah, months. Yeah, the, the Lost Boys. Yeah. One died, right? Renee. Yeah. 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 What's Come his on. name? Uh, what's his name? Got shot. Freaky, Freaky Todd Ty. got murdered. Yeah. So it was Pretty Lou. Spig Nice. Spig, Spig nice. nice was the one that got time for robbery. He got mad years, too. Yeah. Mm. This was long hey time man, ago. Him and Steady B caught time for robbery. Steady B. Come on now. Don't question my hip-hop ever in your Steady life. Steady B from Audio <laughs> too. It's just your taste in it. Ever. <laughs> not wow. your knowledge. He knows. <laughs> yeah, you know, he you just do don't listen to It's not yeah, your knowledge. Before. It's just your... He, he liked them when they was new. Fresh Mac Dre scene. got time for a robbery. Hey, Stop yeah, playing. Yeah, 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 I've never heard of Mac Dre until he died. You're proud of your heroes, DC? Romper Room Crew. Yeah, I've never heard of him until he died. I remember when they were doing that, robbing banks and stuff. We used to be like, man, they really getting away with this. Thing. I remember I got ran up on in, in the crest. Oh, for real? At the Popeyes. Yeah, right by the, yep, right by the crest. Yeah. Mm-hmm. And it was like, I'm in line. And I forgot what he said. He said hey, something. Cuddy. And I was like, <laughs> <laughs> what are you talking about, bro? Like, I forgot what he, and he said something else. But, like, all, all my teammates was there, too. Where were y'all there? One Marine World or something? We had just got back. We just played somebody. Oh, okay. And we was coming back, and we just stopped to eat. So, I'm looking at dude like, was hanging out. is he finna do something? You know what I mean? And I just hear one of my teammates like, hey, bro, we got, like, don't trip. Like, it's 12 of us. You feel me? So they were just like, hey, like, if he start tripping, it's 12 of us. So don't even, right. don't even worry about it. But I'm just like, this nigga got a big ass coat on. I'm like, I don't know what's under this coat. Right. Yeah. But my teammates like, it's 12, like, don't trip. They ended up just leaving, but he, I felt like he was trying to start something. But he didn't want to go with it. 50 people outside. No, no, he was just, and I saw, because we watched him leave. No. <laughs> It was just him, but in the, the homie, I think, and they was like, "Nah, we, we're, we're good." Coats are scary, man. Yeah, I just you didn't like know. the coat. You get a lot of hardware in a coat. Mm-hmm. Remember, we was at Seven Eleven, and that dude was like, "Nice shoes." You oh remember? yeah. He like, "What size is your shoe?" She's talking to me. He's like, "What size?" He said something to me, and then uh, you're like, oh. I was like, "Oh yeah, thank you, bro." <laughs> <laughs> right. And then he, he he turned out to be like a like a goofy dude in the yeah, store, or whatever, yeah, like trying to make everybody laugh, but. B. Lou was like, DC was ready to fight. I was some scared. And I was like, bro, why would I be wanting to? He was a uh, compliment my shoes. <laughs> no, that shoe size, size question yeah. could be different. Yeah, yeah. yeah, I was just like, especially in the freezing like cold. A, like it, was a, it was cold as hell. <laughs> it was mad cold. Plus, it's dim. Well, I don't know. I was taught wrong. I was taught to say, yo size. <laughs> you were taught to automatically just give them up. <laughs> no, that's fighting words when you say yo size. Oh, okay. Like, yo you size. Yo man, what you want to do? What you do? <laughs> Man, grab me, Thank you. Grab me. These are my size. <laughs> when y'all when y'all on the internet looking for stuff, y'all be uh, playing it safe. I need to honestly. I I think about that all the time. Yeah, I'll be too reckless. Yeah, I don't use Google anymore. You don't use Google anymore. Mm-hmm. What you be using? Uh, What's your called, search engine? Uh, 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 not to look on my Pirate side. Bay. No, it's called uh, Duck 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 Go. It's supposed to be like super private and stuff like that oh. that you can't. Oh, really? But you be looking up. You don't yeah. even need that, all though. Kind of, all kind of things. Oh, yeah. But now I don't get those. Uh, when you look up something randomly and then you see it later on, mm-hmm. I don't get those anymore. Be all on your phone. Man, that was whack. Duck feet. <laughs> Talk about Well, you wouldn't need it if you had ExpressVPN. Yeah, exactly. Oh. That's the real one. ExpressVPN. Mm-hmm. Going exactly. online without ExpressVPN is like using your smartphone without a protective case. Most of the time, you'll probably be fine, but all it takes is one accidental drop onto solid concrete to make you wish you had protected yourself. That's true. Why do you need VPN? All right. Every time you connect to, to an encrypted network in cafes, hotels, airports, etc., which I'm always in the airport, I'm always in the hotels, I'm always in all these places except in cafes. I'm never, <laughs> not really there like that, but your online data is not secured. Any hacker on the same network can gain access to and steal your personal data, passwords, financial details, etc. It doesn't take much technical knowledge to hack someone. 
Just some cheap hardware is needed. A smart 12-year-old could do it. Man, if I get robbed by a 12-year-old, mm-hmm. I'm going to be ultimately pissed. Would you, uh, would pulling you fight? Up on, pulling up on his middle school. <laughs> mm-hmm. Like, oh, you savvy, huh? Beat him down with a keyboard <laughs> right there in class. Uh, your data is valuable. Hackers can make up to $1,000 per person selling personal info on the dark web. Wow. Um. Why use ExpressVPN? Encrypted tunnel creates a secure encrypted tunnel between your device and the internet. Hackers can't steal your sensitive data. I really need this because uh, I think I'm I'm getting played right now. Yeah, uh, I think so because I, I see a transaction I didn't recognize, mm-hmm. and uh, I was on the phone all day yesterday. Side note: When you're on the phone with your bank and they they send you the four different Departments, and then you get to that final department. You wait on hold for another hour. They finally get you on there, and then the call drops. Mm. I wanted to punch the solar system in the face. Oh, that's (laughs) annoying as hell, man. And then it was no call back. Mm. Super secure. It'll take a a hacker with a supercomputer over a billion years to get past ExpressVPN encryption. Uh, It's easy to use. Fire up the app and click one button to get protected. (laughs) Works on all devices, phones, laptops, tablets, and more, so you can stay secure on the go. All right? Um, Yeah, I need need to get in on this. I got to get in. It's time. Oh, yeah, it protects the time. Mm-hmm. Hell yeah. yeah. Especially, you know, I'll be out here just at the airport, free you know, ball, Wi Fi and shit. <laughs> wi Fi McGee. Mm-hmm. Tapped into the mm-hmm. hotel Wi Fi yeah, and man. airport Wi Fi. All of it. Plain Wi Fi. the Wi Fi? Because, you know, we fiends <laughs> for the Wi Fi. Yeah, that um, stranger tapping you on, on your phone and it just pop up. Will you accept this guy? You're like, no, yeah, nobody man, cares, man. man. Where he come from? Uh, secure your online data today by visiting expressvpn.com slash issues. That's E-X-P-R-E-S-S-V-P-N dot com slash issues. And you can get an extra three months free. That's expressvpn.com slash issues. Three months free, y'all. You goddamn fool not to take you that got deal. To be no, a no, I, to I think I have it. I don't know how to use it. You got to be a pure you just log dumb, in. Here, dumb <laughs> not to get into this, man. I got to see. see what's going it's on. It's all right. good till you get robbed. Mm-hmm. You know what I'm saying? There's some yeah, questions up in the... Uh, I'm hungry. I see some red. I can't there. see. Hold on. Yeah, I can't see that far either. I'm going to say, what, what was the yeah, first yeah. album? Wait, it already says from a sibling or parent. You stole from your sibling? First album you stole from a sibling I or parent? I don't know if I stole. I we just, just listened to it when my dad wasn't around. I stole. I straight stole. It wasn't a sibling, but I stole. Um, okay, so my boy, Lerone, right? So he had the Nas Illmatic album. And I had Shaim the Rugged Child. I got that. And he was popping. You know, this Wu Tang was cracking. He he was affiliated with Wu Tang, yeah, so I Shaheen. bought his tape, and I was like, "Yo, Shaheen, on and on." <laughs> and you know, I really wasn't rotating the tape like I thought I would, as far on a whole. Mm-hmm. So I was like, "Hey, man, let me uh, let's do a quick trade for a little bit." You know what I'm saying? Let me let me listen to that Illmatic, and I'll, I'll let you listen to the Shaheen. I never gave him. Illmatic back. Yeah, <laughs> Illmatic back. To this day, I still, <laughs> I never gave it back to Lerone, man. My bad, dog. Did he, did he, did he ask you a bunch of times? Yeah, he was like, back? man, you never gave me the uh, Illmatic back. I was like, I know. <laughs> <laughs> I never looked back. <laughs> Dirty so that was like a little theft situation, kind of. And then I stole Kev's uh, records that <clears throat> Tahir gave him. I what? took those records and never gave them back. What records were those? It was like Shaka Khan and like, you know, some more. I was like, Kev ain't going to listen to these. So I just, <laughs> the day he got them, I took them. <laughs> Blatantly. Did Kev ever been like, hey, can I get those back to Because I know Kev ain't going to listen to them, man. So I <laughs> kept the records. The records. First album I, I took was a, was a Ron G mixtape from my cousin Dan. Ron G. It had Real Love a remix. The uh, Mary J. Real Love yeah. on there. Ooh. Did they put that <laughs> remix on there? Uh, remember she came out with the remix album of What's the Four? It was a whole different remix oh. on that album. Yeah. yeah. This was Ron G. Ron G. used to mix all the songs. Yep. I can't remember anything I took from her. Like, my, my dad wasn't around. We would just, like, go and listen to But I remember, remember back to the... Uh, in too deep. deep. Do, 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 he used to play that all the time. Yeah, so I used to listen too. to that. Um, <laughs> he would play because he didn't really listen to hip hop around. Him. My dad was always listening to 
you know, 60s, 70s, and jazz. That was it. Yeah, he never he never played, like, hip-hop. But I know he listened to it. But he just didn't play it around us. Unless it was, like, you know, uh, self-destruct, like the positive stuff. Yeah, self-destruction, summertime, summertime <laughs> things like that. He Parents played. just don't understand. <laughs> yeah, I mean. Self-destruction. We all in the same game. <laughs> oh, he's asking. Yeah, I remember the West Coast the version. Red, white, and blue. And yeah. 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 We're all in the same game. Don't you know? Michelle A. You got to get yourself <laughs> together. <laughs> yeah. Make the change. <laughs> I took Bone Thugs from my cousins. I did that in Cleveland. Was it East 19? Oh, you did it in, in Cleveland? Eternal? Yeah, they had it and I was like. Was it their they first EP or was it The Crossroads? Uh, definitely The Crossroads. It was definitely. They didn't this do was, a lot of videos for that album, which is This crazy, was. Man. I might have talked that in like 90s. Yeah, they just did two videos and called it this. Put a love yeah, money. Man. That, was the first, that was on the EP. Um, anyways, yeah, for my, my cousin Candace. What up, Candace? Oh, you did you ever give it Candace? back? I did. Did I ever take it back? No, I've given enough money since then. But oh, you gave it money? <laughs> That'll never match up. It'll never match up. Do betrayal. y'all listen to music when you like? Do you have music for like different activities? Like you go in the shower, you play something, you go to bed. You miss, do y'all play? Yeah, different? I'm listening yeah. to music pretty much constantly. Yeah, cleaning. Or, you know what I'm saying? Usually, no. Now when I'm cleaning, I'm doing stuff. I I, I listen to YouTube videos. Mm-hmm. Be like the top ten, blah blah blah. And I just have it playing in my pocket. While I'm doing stuff, I thought you like watching the videos too, right? Because mm. this is how you mop the floor. When I work out, I play uh, just music videos and mm. music at the same yeah. time. Yeah. My tattoo guy plays music videos when he's when he's working. Get us something to watch while we're in pain. Yeah, I forgot there was music videos. There, there's so yeah, shit. When you right. watch, that like, used oh, to be snap. life for me, man. man. I used to constantly watch. BET. I used to run home to get to watch 106 all day. Oh, oh, box? Yeah. Mean the box? Right. But I, I hated I hated 106 because they cut off half the video. They used to play, but in commercials, bro. They just yeah. people started making too much. Yeah, man. I like Video Soul and Rap City because yeah, they would show City, you the whole video. video. Soul, I mean, Midnight, Midnight Love, Love. Like Midnight, Midnight Love. Love. Midnight I had Love. BT's schedule yeah. ingrained in here. Go to sleep to Midnight Love. What is it now? I like That's what I'm saying. You got to go to sleep to music, right? Go to sleep to Midnight Love. Yeah, music. I go to sleep to unsung episodes. <laughs> oh yeah, <laughs> <laughs> like last night it was a Sugar Hill Gang. So mm-hmm. I was just like, mm-hmm, mm-hmm. <laughs> and then if, if I I wake up sometimes and rewind, I'll be like, hold on, because it'll go to the next video. I'm like, yeah. who the hell is yeah. this? Yeah, like, yeah, you, I gotta, yeah. <laughs> you wake up, Sugar Hill trying to kill me, man. man. <laughs> hey, after me. <laughs> My man kept saying, a hit, a hit. Man. Man, where do you keep your Sugar phone Hill, at? Where do you played. keep your phone at? Because I'll be trying to watch my YouTube when I sleep. Uh-huh. And but I always touch it, and the video will go off, or you know what I mean, or so yeah, you just let it sit. fall on your face. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> you know, I'm there. more music when I cook. I knew mm-hmm. music when I cook. I watch TV when I cook. We watch some kind of shows or something. I watch a lot of, or if I'm doing stuff, I might have like some kind of anime or something playing. I try not to watch stuff if I'm doing something where I want to be like. Right. I try not to watch because I'll yeah, be looking. I want to watch it. I'm on the burnt the the grits. The only thing I I will watch while cooking is sporting events. Mm-hmm. And then when, the way my kitchen's set up, actually, the TV's behind me, but we don't have a, a on the glass there so I can watch it in the reflection. So mm-hmm. I don't have to keep turning around. Yeah. And I'm like, oh, okay, I can. See. And then you know, if you hear a big dunk or t- you can rewind it. Yeah. You can hit the use to the crowd. Yeah, no, I to, yeah. I listen, I listen to reactions. Yeah, like, right. <laughs> like, they be like, oh, what a sweep! So I'm like, oh, what, 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 what do you do? But other than that, I'm just listening to you know. I've never seen it. You stand there with the skill. <laughs> you But I do. I used to listen to music when I went to sleep. Mm-hmm. And then like, I would listen to like like guap like soothing stuff, Sade, guap like oh, whatever, closer, just soothing. Man. Discovery I used Channel. I listen to yeah. hard rap, rap. Like when I would fall asleep, the headphones on. I remember listening to Ja Rule's three <laughs> six. What was it three three thirty six? Three thirty six. Back in like whatever year that was, yeah. being like just taking you into the hole where you wake up aggressive and shit. <laughs> That's before the super singing and shit. When this cat was actually still. Hard. No, he was singing there. I thought you was I falling asleep. So. What? Three thirty six. First time. Got to do. Oh, I guess God it was a second. But what was on there? I can't remember even the. Uh... He had the song with Vita on that album. Ooh, we'll be without you. Oh, okay, okay, okay. Yeah, he okay. was definitely singing. Yeah, yeah, okay. But that with Holla Holla. Nah, it's Holla Holla was on Vinny Vinny Betty or whatever. Yeah, that was yeah, a yeah. debut. Discovery Channel is what you should listen to. Oh, that'll put me to sleep. Oh, yeah. That's the best. That's good. That's good. Going to sleep. Me smooth. Shark Week stuff like that. It's good going to sleep. I'm mean, be watching like mostly, yeah, some kind of anime or something. And I wake up like, damn, 12 episodes pass. Mm-hmm. I'm like, oh shit, which one was I on? The reason why I try to do music versus TV, because sometimes, you know, for something like a commercial can be real loud or the flashing sometimes will wake me up. Mm-hmm. And I don't want to be woken up. So the music don't wake me back up. 
Mm. But like TV stuff has different triggers, right? I'd be like, oh hell. Yeah. And then you get reused, like you said, well shit, well, let me rewind it and well, see. I'm, now I'm up again. I'm rewinding. <laughs> yeah, I'm rewinding every like, time. Hold on, I do man, rain. I this. Eleven hours of rain. That don't be doing it. Make it for me gotta me. go pee, but <laughs> the boys do the, the water, the, the nature sounds I'll just be like, This is annoying. <laughs> no, you can wake up and watch it on YouTube on TV, be like, oh, okay. Yeah, they'd be having visuals that reloop. Maybe them Sabrina ones. be putting that on sometimes when she sleep. I go in there, I hear some rain. It'd be like a soft storm. Yeah. Some rain. But like, this is nice. Man. We want real rain. Give me the real one. I don't <laughs> sick of made up see, rain, man. bro. <laughs> you just be sleep with the shower on, like yeah, man, like give rain. <laughs> water bill high as hell. <laughs> mm-hmm. Hit my window pane. Give me my, give me my nice pillow and the music. I'm out, man. Yeah, you got a purple pillow. That's your damn right. Uh, you sure with the grids. Yeah, I like the grids. I like. Yeah. I'm a fan. I like the grids. I'm a fan. Cotty takes mine when I'm out of town. I could always see my pillow on her side of the yeah, bed. I'm like, get off, my, get off my Sabrina pillow. Sabrina been man. eyeballing my pillow. Yeah. Like, look out. <laughs> yeah. Look out. That's because Purple Mattress has the, the gel flex grid. That's what we're talking about with the grid. It's a mm-hmm. super stretchy, ultra squishy material that apply, uh, adapts and flexes around the pressure points, and it doesn't retain heat. That's another thing, too. My yeah. pillow, don't, like, there's it no cool side cool. of the pillow. It's always chill. Yeah. And I don't have to, like, you know how you have to fold over regular pillows mm-hmm. and all? I don't have to do that with this. You just put it on there and that, that flex grid is Y'all legit. need to get in on these pillows. Y'all yeah, need to man. get in on stuff. I'm sick of you three just sitting over there. <laughs> I'm just trying to wait for it to Clueless. come out to fit Except my king Hello size Fresh. pillow. Yeah, oh, you get the king size. I don't know. I got to see it there. I can't, I, can't get the, I can't get the purple mattress right now because I got a sleep number bed. So I can't get the... Yeah. How's I'm the sleep number? I'm, sure. I'm supposed to be getting dope. the mattress. I thought. Yeah. Right. We're going to come uh, uh, get on your mattress. Yeah, we're going <laughs> to test it out. It's supportive on your it's back and legs while uh, cushioning your shoulders, your neck. <laughs> he got to protect hips. his neck. <laughs> <laughs> no matter what, no matter how you sleep. Keon always, me and Keon got the same shoulders. You're the nah, wider than mine, bro. No, he has DC raw got shoulders. The shoulder shoulders, though. You got his, like, the big brother version of his yeah. shoulders. Yeah. Oh, I'm just over here like, can I have some more? <laughs> you know? Can I have some more? Unlike, uh, <laughs> <laughs> some more? unlike memory foam, <laughs> which remembers uh, everything thanks to the gel flex I'm grid. I remember this. <laughs> but, uh, purple mattress bounce back as soon as you move and shift. So there's no, it doesn't stay like that. It just, it just bounces back. You'll never have that I'm stuck feeling when your people are getting the memory foam. Uh, try your purple mattress risk-free. Free shipping and returns. Yeah. Financing available, too. Mm. Oh, uh, great night's sleep starts with having a great mattress. Get a purple mattress. Go to purple.com slash issues. Use the code issues. issues. For limited time, you can get 10% off any order of $200 or more. Mm. So that's uh, purple.com slash issues. Code issues. issues for 10% off on any order, $200 or more. Purple.com slash issues. Promo code Issues. That's a great deal, man. Yeah. I would have the purple joint if it, it cause the sleep number it, it's I like I ordered it. it's two right. different sides. So they can't unless they can do a mattress that could get right. a little split down the middle. Be a goddamn fool not to get that deal. Man, oh, right. get in on it. Get the pillows, y'all. Start start off with the pillows and then you you advance. The pillows time. honestly sold me on the mattress. Yeah, and man. I was like, yeah. I'm, I need these three knuckleheads. Me and uh, me and y'all were sleeping man. in separate beds and be so wonderful. You say what? We've been sleeping in separate beds. Oh, marital beds. Oh, y'all oh, doing nice. the I Love Lucy? The... That's great. No, it's my... damn hot thighs. <laughs> <laughs> well, we both got some thighs. Uh, cause well, y'all you know, got two beds in the same room? No. Uh, uh-uh. But, you know, my I mean, my place ain't that big. The daughter's room across it. But that has my old king size bed. Mm. So, you know, because Izzy, Izzy, my daughter, if she's by herself in her bed, she's coming for you. Yeah. She's like, I'm not doing this. You put her back in, she'll go back to sleep, and then she'll, you'll wake up, damn, right there. Yeah. Like, How'd you get back? So sometimes, you know, you might sleep with her, but I think, I think we did at least for like five days in a row. We slept separate We were both like, this is great. Mm. It's like, why, why is it great? Was y'all, yeah, what are y'all just, doing? Just was y'all the, piled up? No, nah, it's just the, the space. You're not ever... Fighting for blankets, you're never oh, fighting for. Fight. You can you can move. Nerves, you just maybe. you just have it all. You have yeah. a whole bed. To, it's, I no, think y'all ain't spooners, huh? I, well, I mean, you can do that, but then it's like uh, it's high. You change sometimes. You change at night. Sometimes I'm cold. You, be, you know, you change. And uh, yeah. some of you be sweating at something a certain night. Well, I'm other not time. spoony McGee at all. No, nah, I just be like, you need every adult man. You need your own bed. I'm John with a spoon. <laughs> nah, I like. <laughs> I like. Spoon. Spoon. I like y'all don't be cuddling. No, I like sleep. I need her leg on me to sleep. No, nah. I don't need that. Like, yeah. just until I'm good. But I don't like her. Like, I sleep no cover. I be hot. 
Mm-hmm. And she sleep bundled up, blanket, blanket, blanket. So cool, one time though. she slept like on me. I, this whole side of my body, I was sweating. Yeah. Like my arm was, I woke up like, and I'm like, you can't sleep. I just need your leg and then I'm on that top of the That shit's so covered. cute, That's but it. that shit, sleeping by yourself, it's wonderful. Yeah. I, I would like agree. It's like peace. But, like by, it. but by the middle of the night, we both didn't. Yeah. Split, like you gonna back. separate anyway. Yeah. Hey, come here, baby. Um, I didn't need to fall asleep. I don't be, and then... I'm usually not comfortable spooned up. You don't even nah. start start off with the cut. No, the shoulder. It, you can't. It's fine on the start, but then you would be like, it's uncomfortable. And we go to sleep at different times, anyways. You know, yeah. they 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 be all knocked out. Be they up. knock out. Then I gotta come in and. Be all Starts okay. with a separate room, next separate house. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, that's what they say. But love that's a separate starts, house, bro. <laughs> Yo, wants her own. She's like, she just likes shit her own way, which I get. I feel it. I feel 100%. it too. I get Couple, it. Couple couples lose sight of that. Yeah. They were we doing everything together. People will I get, get on the, your I get the separation. As soon as we get that, the, when this garage is done and it's, it gets converted into his room, I'm probably gonna spend the majority of my time. Mm-hmm. Yeah. In that room, by my damn. Bro, side. I've been, I like, I've been trying to game lately, and I gotta like move the. They all wanna be in the living room. I go take my shit into the, my room. Then get to bed. Go take my family shit. Family want to spend <laughs> time. Man. It's not that they want to spend time with me. They're just in this room. So I'm like, well, I got to take my shit out of here. Yeah. Let me go over here. Play Call of Duty with us, man. I'm gonna get it, dog. Cause now I got to get good at it. Wait, what you got to like, like be regular right now? I have a king size. No, I thought in the other. You got a king size in both rooms. So you got two king oh, sizes. Okay. Yeah. My daughter is on a king, baby. We ain't doing that. I heard that, that. twin stuff. Man, y'all spoiling okay. this girl, man. She's, she's getting kind of spoiled. She's on the yeah, she can't sleep by herself. But she's getting spoiled in a different way. Like, but that's always what been a thing. I'll put her and get she'll to when she back. gets to a husband. That's only when you got only child. She got to do a double spoiled. king. Well, she's gonna have to do a whole kingdom. <laughs> <laughs> that's how she's supposed to be. Okay. A kingdom size bed. So when do y'all sleep with that? her and when do y'all sleep? It just depends, because like we even if we sleep in our own bed, we'll put Izzy in there, she's coming, and then you'll put her back in. And you be like, stay in your bed. And she goes, okay. So and where are you sleeping when you're sleeping in a separate bed? <laughs> okay. well, that's because a king okay. size bed is in got my you. bed or in Izzy's bed. So you're you not sleeping by yourself then. It, well, I'm saying like, well, it, well, Izzy's really small compared to the king. But it just depends if you start off by yourself. Izzy's coming for you. But you said you and Yo have been sleeping in separate beds. We've been like, sleeping in separate beds. you like sleeping beds. by yourself. But at the end of the day, you're not sleeping by yourself. Well, if, if Izzy's Either taking turns coming back. But Izzy's small. Izzy, Izzy can be over here and I can be over here in the king. But in the king, both two adults... There's been times I didn't even know Cody was in the bed. There's yeah, room, kings, but it's yeah, big, No, no, I'm not bro. saying there's not, but it's not like being by yourself in your bed. You're still going to run into that person. You want to roll all over the bed have, at wait, night? Do you have a king? <laughs> I do. Yeah. I have a, four, oh, no, I have a queen. Okay, so if a, a I was queen. Izzy, I'd be scared in a king size bed. Why? It's too big. Oh, it's it's massive. It's she got to roll like 20 times. I don't think it's as big. It's not that big. I'm saying a king is enough for two No, for a child, for for sure. But the king size bed is really not that big. No, it's really not that big. I don't be noticed. Like, the kids will come get in our, like, on weekends, mm-hmm. we like to sleep in. They will come get in our bed, and all four of us can fit in there just mm-hmm. fine. Like, I just literally fine. would put two kings together if I could. I would definitely do that for a bed. You need a Cali King. I have a Cali King. Shit. But they're yeah. not that they're they're not that big. They're really not that big. Like from the, a queen to a king, it's a lot more space, but it's not that big. Like you still gonna run into somebody. If I'm laying out on my bed, you need that I have to shack lay, bed. Yeah, I have to lay it like this way. We all have to file in and then we can fit. No, you could lay with your arms spread, feet spread, and it's still but, gonna be by yourself. Room, not bro. with two people. You can't do that with two people. Can't sit there and sprawl out. Hell no. I don't I, I see. Hell no. And, yeah, I don't see a king being that small. Like, You're not gonna sprawl out in the middle of your bed and not run into somebody. Not in the middle. Also There's sprawling. sides. Well, that's yeah. what I'm saying. I'm not doing a side anymore. He I get my own bed. Just jumping jack in the middle the of the middle. bed. Yes. <laughs> so you just want the middle of the bed. You don't want to. I want the bed too for me, and she has a bed for her. And we're both great. If we wake up, we mm, be high five. Wait, but if you get two king size, that means you're going to sleep in the middle of the two king size. That's bed. right. That's right. You greedy ass. That is correct. Chasman. And I'm just going to have food around me, surrounding me. So no matter which way I wake up, <laughs> there's food. There's so when you, when, you sleep in the, when you sleep in the middle of the king size, you don't feel Izzy. No, no. I hardly ever. Because unless Izzy's coming towards you because she wants your body heat. Like Izzy, Izzy, she might back She's up. A vampire but I, I'll, I'll separate Izzy. Here's a pillow here and a yeah. pillow here. Izzy's trapped. She be in there stuck, <laughs> at, at, rolling around because she's a mover, bro. Yeah. So otherwise, I'd never even run into Izzy. Never run into Izzy if you just got to give her a little bunker. And she's I'm a fine. bum at the end of the day. I'll sleep on the couch. Mm. Oh yeah. Till the cows come home. A couch oh sleep is solid, though. Couch sleep feel better. People, people disrespect couches all the time. I like couch like, sleep. This is valid sleep. Yeah. Valid. I never understood how that was a punishment. 
Like when you watch a movie or something, you're on the couch, and I'd be like, "Great, all right." <laughs> Most of the time, I only get up because you'd be like, "Come to bed." I yeah. would pass out on this couch. You I don't give the a TV damn. Just TV chilling. on, and I'm propped up. And especially mm-hmm. you got the long. You know what I mean? I'm, I'm good. The couch is good sleep. Me and Sabrina both. We went to sleep on the couch the other night. We were just both knocked out. I was like, yeah, we be, this man, is life, I'll, man. I'll be randomly passed out on the recliner, man. too. Yeah, the recliner couch, it's a the recliner, recliner sleep ain't as good as lay down couch sleep. I'm talking about where you can just lay all the way out. I'd oh, rather yeah, be in the recliner than the, lay, than the layout. Ah, I like them both, actually. The recliner give you a good two and a half hours right. of good sleep. That's not, I want that <laughs> good. But then you wake up, you're like, ah, let me unfold. Yeah, Cause Cause there's something about sleeping in a seated position. Ah, you never feel like you fully that's what I'm supposed saying. to be asleep. In a recliner, you can't get to turn yeah. in and, you know, but I mean, to lay down on the couch, Ooh, that's that beautiful real. Beautiful times. Yeah. And you I wake like up confused, down. like, <laughs> what that years? Re- that recliner sleep be so good, you jump and be out of it. Like, oh, shit. I was I like floating. What is that jerk? What is that when you be like, <laughs> oh. <laughs> Yeah, that quick. My legs really jump. Instant dream. Well, you just dozed off and then you fell already in the dream. <laughs> <laughs> I had a dream one time. So looking around. <laughs> my dad fell out laughing. We were driving back. From I think one of my games, mm. and I woke up and and slapped the dashboard, <laughs> and he was like, "What the hell was you doing?" I was like, "I was on a fast break." <laughs> and I it. So I woke up and just I slapped that dashboard hard as hell. He was like, "What the hell was that?" I was like, "It was a two hand." <laughs> he fell out laughing. You was in full dream, bro. Full Man. dream. He's full like, you ain't dream. recorded. Full dream. That's mad funny. That's great. I, I gotta get out of here. Okay. Where get you going, best, man? man? We just getting started. Okay. You know he back in school. I gotta go pick him up. Oh back yeah, in that, yeah. He, back, he was excited too. I cut his hair yesterday, and he he hasn't been able to wear his Christmas clothes yet. Oh, oh, right so oh. he boy, he was like, all right, I'm gonna put this. Out. He put on everything. He <laughs> laid his outfit out. Oh, I'm putting my new shoes. With my, all right, put that out. He's like, I'm about to be killed. He was in the mirror. He was like, okay, I got, okay, yeah. Did great. you show like, him how to do it, or did he have some? <laughs> no, nah, they got tech it, bro. Way. They got it now. Like he when he picked out his outfit, he's like, okay, the blue with the blue and then the hat. Like they got it. They I thought on. they might have the tech where they could slide outfits on their nah. picture. They just be they they just know how to put stuff together now. Be like, all right, I'm gonna put this. You got the red here. Okay, I'll wear my red shoes. I'm like, right. oh, dipped in butter. I'm like, all right, all right. I'm he gonna like, do a quick question from S. Jones, real let's quick. Do it. What's up, S. Jones? Think back to your young 20s. Mm. Mm-hmm. Your close relative slash friend is denying a child with his ex. You want to take him on Maury for a DNA test. He asks you to join him as a character witness. What would your reaction slash response have been? Early twenties, ah, this is gonna be hilarious. <laughs> like, yeah, let's go. Like, this is gonna be fun. Cause more, more was popping up in, in the early twenties, <laughs> and we don't know the results or anything. Yeah, yet. we no. just take it on the show. I'm like, so we, is, is I'm just looking at it like I'm going on TV. Friend slash relative. Yeah, let's go. So, I'm either gonna say oh or ah. Right. Like this. I'm going. I'm going. I'm not doing that shit. It's a funny story. Mm-hmm. Uh, oh, you ain't going. <laughs> uh, Craig. Oh, you Craig was uh, on Craig did it. <laughs> my voice was on. Uh, my voice was on. Was it Maury or Ricky Lake? It was, <laughs> the, the topic of the show was my boys dating a hoe. And oh, he don't know it. Is. And uh, they all got this little thing together. One of our boys was dating this girl that was pretty. Uh, she was seeing other people at the school. And uh, they wanted me to fly out there, but I was a PA on the show at the time. And uh, I was like, I can't, man. I thought that was going to be good enough. They called me at my job while I was answering phones to be like, Craig, tell him, ain't he dating a hoe? And I was like, yeah, I got to go back to work. <laughs> <laughs> he said, yeah. Later, yeah. Yeah, I got to go I was like, back. yeah, I got to go back to work. <laughs> The worst so, person. <laughs> yeah, she's definitely. Yeah, she's, 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 she's definitely. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. I, yep. Oh, she's she's sure is. Is. I gotta get out. Everybody hit. <laughs> yeah, I'm not doing it, bro. I'm going. I used to be my twenties, man. I used to look at Maury like these people are trash on here. Oh, they were definitely trash, but I'm just like, the witness. But oh, you my still boys got part girls of it. when they came. No, I'm home. So, I know, I get it. But when you watch, you be like, I used to be one of those people like, why are they doing this? Yeah, he was almost on. But I used to they cutting us back. They setting us back. They fighting on there. Like when Jerry oh. used to fight, I used to be in Man. tears. Oh, Jerry was. It's crazy. funny. It's funny to watch, but to be a part of it, to be like, oh. The truth is, they really are that shady though on them shows. Like they the girl flew fast. out there and fast. didn't even know the show was called "I'm Dating a Hoe." It's so she went out there thinking, "Oh, we gonna be on TV. It's oh, gonna wow. be all this." And then they said, "Just like, and a come on out. Here's the hoe." Damn, that's <laughs> cold. <laughs> Yeah, it was too many gimmicks for me to be like. It, it, it got it got to be sitting on stage. Me, right. Whatever, whatever. <laughs> when it was Y'all brand new, me. it was funny, and then mm. it was like I was it, I got like you like okay this is yeah. a, which is which started my reality TV hate. 
Right. When right. stuff got too sloppy, they would like, just come out there swinging. Fighting, bro. Every, <laughs> man. <laughs> Every episode. But I would more laugh titty, 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 titty. the absurdity, like, you know, like, the like you see two little people yeah. or like you know big old girl some skinny like that would, would make me laugh it's right. like this is ridiculous definitely entertaining this I don't think I would want to be a circus, part of it I, I like the better when I thought the fights were real I was think they probably old? started off real was that on Jerry Springer too, yeah and then. Jerry Springer the fights were real yeah cause that's where Chicago people were I think they started out real <laughs> I think they yeah. started and then, and then, they, they then got, it became a thing fit. cause then they Come started cause then they started going ding ding yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> no, that's, that, <laughs> like they, that's just when they let you go. They're like, "Hey, let's." No, get they would come dudes. out. Sometimes they'd come out the gate and they would just hit it and they, <laughs> to make them fight. Yeah. It was like pitbull, but, but that <laughs> could have been added later, though. That's like, that's like, added added the post. Post. Yeah, <laughs> but the fact that they would just come in swinging they first because <laughs> that's what they would do is right before you went out, they'd be like, "Oh yeah, by the way, and uh, he's fucking your wife." Go. Yeah. Yeah. You can you can Ding fight on here. Yeah, they would let the fight yeah. calm down. But I don't think it was done in post again. because a lot of times like Jerry would be mid talk, he'd be like, blah blah. Ding ding. Yeah. Like, All right. <laughs> and, they would, and they would start fighting. Like, it was it was like animals. Did you ever go to one of those shows? I went to Jenny Jones. Uh, the Jerry Springer line was too long. Okay. So I gotta I got look <laughs> in the Jenny audience Jones. for you. Because I see a D Ray in the audience of the other one. I was like, oh, all the Chicago yeah. comments. My front uncle front. said something on the on the Jenny Jones joint. But I feel like they didn't air it, so they they aired my girl uh, Shantae because she had said something too. I was like, "Oh, y'all gonna be on TV?" We was all sitting together, and then they just they edited his part out because he went off, and then the crowd reacted. I'm like, "Look at Carl!" Now <laughs> <laughs> isn't the, isn't it crazy the excitement about being on TV before we were actually right. on oh, TV? Yeah. Like, <laughs> it, was, it was everything, yeah, man. Like, like, I gotta watch that Jenny Jones audience. Episode. Right, my mom and them were on Family Feud. Uh, and we were like, "Wow, man." <laughs> Wow, we you got the tape. It. But yeah, now we're on. We're like, no, yeah, how'd they I don't do? Care. They lost. They my, lost. My auntie choked. It's, it's funny how they call you a, a star when you do the first thing, but towards the last thing, they're like, ah, oh, nah, he a has been. Like, but I was a star for this Burger King commercial. <laughs> right. Y'all was on me. It was, it, it I did 80 movies then. since then. It was different. Right, man. <laughs> We saw you too much. Be like DC. I don't know. I just got tired of seeing you. <laughs> Jerry was so big. That cat Steve got a show. Yeah. Steve Wilkins. And that was just so Fight cool. McGee. Yeah. Like, he was all in. Like Steve was breaking up the fights. Steve was breaking. Steve was a security dude. He was. And now he's on there. So you're having marital problems. Yep. Like, what are you that's talking about? That's crazy, bro. Steve, yeah. Steve, yeah. Steve, yeah. Like, that's how big Jerry was. That's Jerry, like, it was like wrestling, guard. bro. He was insane. The security guard. That changed the game for him. The fights changed his life. Yeah. Oh, yeah. For sure. He, he probably was the one ringing the bell. Right. Yeah. Ding, ding, ding. I think yeah, the first movie fight come out on Geraldo. Yeah, the movie? It's called Ringmaster. Oh, Spring. <laughs> that. Yeah. Jerry. Oh, oh. I know Who else yeah, has spinoffs? I know Rachel Ray was a spinoff, right? Rachel Ray? Was a spinoff of Oprah. What is he or somebody? No, well, Rachel Ray got a bunch of No, no, no. Dr. Oprah. Oz and them was a spinoff. Dr. Phil, Dr. Oz. Dr. Phil was a spinoff. And okay. also Oprah her best friend. They, a yeah, lot of them spin off from, not a, not a, from a different source. Right. Okay. Yeah, they Dr. rarely Phil. just come in. Dr. Phil not a doctor. Dr. Phil not a doctor? Like, at all. Dr. Phil not a doctor? If he's he's a him or Dr. Dr. J. Dr. J not a doctor? <laughs> no. One of them is not he's a doctor. He's a doctor of Duncan. Dr. Dre. Dr. Dre is not a doctor? He's a doctor of music. You, what do y'all know? I thought Dr. Phil was a doctor. One of them wasn't a doctor. Dr. Phil better be a doctor because he rep it hard. Yeah. He got the doctor haircut. I seen him <laughs> driving one time in the Range Rover. Yeah, said, said yeah, it there camp? it is. A lot of times it's an honor. Oh. Ah, right. Look like Dr. Man. Shaq. Yeah. Shaq. Sheriff Shaq. Right, He's we, a doctor, too. That's the sheriff. That's doctor. the yeah, everything. Yeah. Yeah. Shaq is just do it and go for it. Him, and, him and Arnold are just like, we just going to do it. Mm -hmm. Hey, Schwarzenegger. Yeah, I respect it. I'm you got to respect Schwarzenegger, mm -hmm. bro. Came to a different I'm country and became job. governor. To a different bro, Bill Burr's joke on that, just that's his great, timeline bro. is insane. It's incredible. He's a crazy. great man. And he it's was crazy. like, fuck that. I'm going to be governor <laughs> of a, in a country I can't even speak the language. That's crazy. <laughs> Why wouldn't he think he could smash his maid? He's been in a zone for <laughs> years. Man, so true. <laughs> Killing it. Killing it. Yeah, that's great. It, no man, you imagine that you're the world's strongest man. You got he got you're a movie star buff. without saying any words in Terminator. You're huge. Then you start going your action movies, and then yeah, and then you're then you go go hey, he's on his way to president. Hey, he may right. marry into a family. If he was family. if he was born here, yeah, he could be on his way to be president. I used I'll to serve bad. him at the restaurant I worked at. Arnold? I, yeah, Arnold. When I tell you his head was huge, I bet. No, I bet. Was <laughs> like like real life Arnold. That's yeah, the Roy. It's, it's huge as hell. Was bro. he nice? He was cool. Yeah. He'd always come in with his little crew of bike riding. He wasn't, yeah, he was a cool dude. Simple. Yeah. Didn't notice him or, you know what I mean? He wasn't doing too much. He was cool. 
He wasn't like, I'm the Terminator. <laughs> Give me my fucking <laughs> apple. <laughs> <laughs> he wasn't in there <laughs> doing all that. He was chill, bro. I, <laughs> I wish I could put that. He was chill. Yeah. Thank what, you. What's your favorite Arnold movie before we get out of here? Oh. Loki? Twins or Kindergarten Cop? Well, twins okay. are solid. Both solid. You got to pick one, though. Mine, I'm going to throw y'all for a loophole. No. Running Man, baby. Okay. Running, I like running, running Man. Baby. Okay. I was just looking at the uh, host, the one that was uh, Richard Dawson. Richard Dawson. I wanted, his, I wanted to wear that outfit. I wanted to kiss everybody, every woman that came on my TV <laughs> show. That's <laughs> what like, he did. Richard for Dawson. Sure. Yeah, running Man, baby. Was my family front your husband. McGee. He was kissing everybody. So what's, that, what's that kissing disease? Uh, mono. 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 Spreading mod, mad mono out there. Uh, T2, my favorite. Uh, I gotta agree with you. That was my mm-hmm. second one. T2. Yeah. Yeah. I T2. was like, this movie? Yeah. Um, who was that guy? Who was the other Terminator? Who was he that was bad for real. Robert Patrick. I, what else? I've never heard of him. Oh, yeah. Or what else he's done? Uh, he was a uh, regular on the X Files. He's been oh, working. He's been I'm sure. He's, I'm yeah. sure he's been working. Yeah. But I was just like, yo. He was on Sons of Anarchy for a while. Mm-hmm. Okay. Yeah. He's but been when he, I just seven. remember watching that. My dad was like, yo, this white boy can run. That he was, was really running. That was he my was intro moving. to him. He was really running. It? He was. Yeah. He had to be running. Do, 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 do. He's on that bike and he blew him off and he split. I was like, ah. That movie, Yo, was was that movie changed the game. That movie mm-hmm. blew my head off. Mm-hmm. I got one for y'all. What's oh. that? What's that? Hercules goes to New York. That ain't <laughs> your favorite, though. Yeah. What you mean? You just throwing that shit was movies funny. out there. That ain't your favorite Arnold movie. How you gonna tell me? Because we know how you do. <laughs> I don't believe you. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> it was T2. It was T2. It was T2. Was T2. T2. Uh, the three T2s, a running man. What did you say last week? Did you say twins? Or, or, uh, crazy, crazy, damn, bro. Kindergarten cop, one of my kids. God damn it. Don't look at me with them eyes for the truth. <laughs> <laughs> Kindergarten cop was so funny. Oh, Kenny Kenny was was great. Yeah. Kenny 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 Twins was good too. I, like I tried to watch the last action hero again. I, like I didn't movie. like it back then. It wasn't. It's bad. good now. Yeah, it's not mm-hmm. bad. Yeah. I, I, I just I just it. don't I couldn't remember it. Then I was trying to watch. It I wasn't think Hercules I got bored, Ghost but. to New York. <laughs> <laughs> Did Arnold do any love stories? Oh, you know what else was good? I forgot about True Lies. I remember loving True Lies, bro. True, True Lies was with, with Jamie Lee. Jamie Lee, yeah. Jamie Lee stole the show. What about Conan and the Barbarian, guys? Oh, that was, was a good cool. one. That was a good time. Grace True. Jones. True Lies. I really liked uh, Will Chamberlain. Commando back in the day. Oh, Predator Commando. is outstanding. Predator was yeah. fire. But I was out here. Super fire. Yeah. Wasn't yeah. Ray Don Chong in Commando? Yes. Yes, yeah. she was. She was killing in the 80s. But T2. T2, yeah, for sure. That was T2. T2 was great, bro. We should have took T2 off the table. Okay, Why? taking T two off the table. Why are you taking T two off the table? I'm gonna give it to Predator, uh, <laughs> and we gotta take uh, <laughs> to Hercules goes to New, New York, York off the table. table. We taking <laughs> it off the table. I didn't even know, I didn't know that movie. That was. Yeah. Never heard of it. it was his comedy. He played Hercules, and he was kind of like coming to in America. New York. People uh, were sleep on Red what? Heat with him and James Belushi. I don't remember that. Oh, y'all ain't seen that? Oh, no. so. I seen it. you said people be sleep on it. Yeah, Red Heat. Never heard Arnold of Arnold and James Belushi. This is a good one. Actually, Around what time was that? 88. So Predator time. 88, 89. Huh. Same, around it was time. after Predator. Okay. Yeah. I would have to say Commando like, too. I got that little Commando knife afterwards. Yeah. The dude with the bad haircut head. The dude that did the music for 48 hours came back with the same soundtrack. <laughs> oh, that's funny. <laughs> I was like, I'm going to play this for Commando as well. <laughs> but yeah. Where you at, DC? Uh, Hawaii, Maui, and Waikiki. Ooh, hey. You performing there? Yeah, four oh, shows. Man, nice. Nice. Beautiful. Been Dang. there a couple Lamar? times. Lamar. Man, man, what fruits are you going to get out I'm getting there? pineapple. I'm juicing they now. They need to open for that. Pull up. Pull up. <laughs> <laughs> but no, I, I can't just pull up and just hey, you know, hold for the big. Y'all got to book me as the opener. <laughs> you, you know how we do. Get there. <laughs> uh, you ain't coming. Get that there. sounded shady. I ain't never been to And then he put it on you. Right. You show up. I'm going to make sure you get some stage Is it this weekend? It's, we leave Friday. It's Friday, Saturday. Okay. Yeah. Two days of beautifulness. Man, I've never been to Mount. You? What you? At? I love. Man. I never been to Hawaii. Yeah. I'm yeah. at Craig Wayne's I'm everywhere, man. At, at Craig. At Craig Wayne's on everything. I gotta go somewhere nice. That's what I'm just thinking now. I gotta go. Uh, uh, um, um, um. Um. What's my name? Uh, Chaz Rogers. <laughs> uh, laugh at Chaz on YouTube. Uh, me and Lack have more episodes come out. I think we're going to change the podcast into Lackaroni and Chaz because it made us laugh. Lackaroni and Chaz. Yeah, and so uh, drop that. Uh, yeah, and that's it. And then uh, laugh. Uh, I'm Chaz Rogers on IG, but I don't really be posting, but you can go. But YouTube, I'll be going live and shit. It's going to be a good time on YouTube now. Oh, so right. pull up. Okay. 5.30-ish. Five-ish, five-ish. Right. Five-ish. Oh, show yeah. too. I am, uh, Sunday I'm at the Laugh Factory, um, and then on the 22nd I'm in Renton, Washington, the Cargo Theater. Y'all make sure y'all pull up for that. If you're in Seattle and Tacoma, it's right in between 
Seattle and Tacoma. People are like, why didn't you come to Seattle? Why didn't you come to Tacoma? Because I'm coming to Renton. Come to Renton. Yeah. Renton. Seattle and Tacoma didn't want me, but Renton was like, pull up. It's right in the middle. It's right in the middle. You ain't so got no excuses. It's a, yeah, it's a t- 15 minute drive. You ain't Just got come. no excuses. Uh, one night, Saturday, and then uh, the <laughs> I Don't Care hoodies are dropping, uh, I think, in like a week. So look out for those. And uh, oh, Patreon, for those of you who don't know. Uh, me, Keenan Baker, and Gary Anderson are doing a, another a YouTube show, and uh, you can watch that live like you do Daddy Issues. And then me and Cotty are bringing back our Thursday night thing, which would be only on the Patreon. So mm-hmm. make sure you check that out. That's it. Yeah. I forgot one thing. Prove oh. it, Beanies. DCIrvinComedy dot com. Get a yeah. prove it. Beanies. Yeah. Prove yeah. it. Thanks for, and thank you for those who came to Phoenix. I appreciate it, man. Thank you so much. What was that? It was a good time. What you yeah, got, Tony? Uh, uh, Pittsburgh, January 20th to the 22nd. Get your tickets early. Tickets on sale for my whole tour right now, except for Richmond. Richmond hasn't posted. I don't know what the Richmond Funny Bone is doing, but you can't get tickets there yet. But you can get tickets in any city I'm coming to. Just check the lineup. No excuses. Um, <laughs> Pittsburgh show out. Pittsburgh, man. Pull up. Port, pull, up. Hell. pull up. Pittsburgh. Pull up to these shows. Swissville. So we're going to be stressed. Um, and then uh, we'll you can get the damn Rudy hoodies for damn a couple Rudy. more days. You can get them now. You, I think you got two days left. I got uh, mine. So get that. Uh, click the link in my bio on my Instagram. And I uh, know I'm forgetting something, but uh, don't forget to tune in to Verbal Cardio, man. Uh, you know what I'm saying? Every two more Wednesday. things. Hey, Cam, when does the animation podcast drop? Uh, animation. This Friday I was on there with uh, Cam and Keenan Baker. You remind me of that. And then uh, happy anniversary to my wife. I love you. Oh. Yeah. Happy anniversary, uh, baby. You getting her own bed? Happy brother. anniversary, baby. <laughs> uh, I just want to say right. how much. I, where you guys going? That's you guys, y'all supposed to back uh, me up, man. Y'all oh, yeah, I, I, I you were supposed listen. to come in. Happy, and you happy, happy anniversary. Happy anniversary, yo. Today's a special day. There it is. Not yeah. just any day. Yeah. Yeah. You can have everything. That's what I was trying to keep you all up. Yeah. Tell your supervisor you're leaving early today. Craig, take it away. I for the rest Keon, of the day. Keon, take it away. Yeah. Do you know what to say? It's our oh, anniversary. Keon, you read it. How much can we sing without being sued? That was probably, <laughs> we're probably getting sued. Probably take down this whole video. We got the words right. <laughs> the breakdown, that's the best part. I know, yeah. girl. I know. Get down off the table, Tony. <laughs> Tony just stole my wife and said, We out. Oh, <laughs> oh, table back. Do you know Tony somehow you in his drawers on a piano. Oh, you're on a piano. Right. All right, y'all. We out. <laughs>